Now my phone wants to go off. Now, now my phone wants to go off when I'm live. What's up, Kamai? What's good with it? Let's see. Let's see uh, who all jumps in here. Wait up. Kamai is the first one in the building. I know I don't look bright because of the lighting, but I'm going to try to scoot you guys closer right here so you can see what I got going down. I'm about to make the chile verde. Kamai shadow came in quick. What's happening with it? I'll see you, brother. I got only two minutes left on new Super Northendo video. <laughs> hey, watch it, bro. It's a funny one, huh? I'm telling you right now, that shit was hilarious. It was a good one, man. We got three in the building. Make sure you guys hit those likes on the way in and out. I appreciate it. I'm trying to make sure everything's good. Juan Garcia says, orale gunner, saludos. What's up, brother? How you doing? Again, man, I'm going to be cooking, so it's going to be hard for me to pay attention to everyone. Can you guys hear me all right or what? Let me know. And I'm sorry it's too bright in here. Let me see. Maybe I'll turn this off. And... Nope. Hey, the Alpha All of Feminist says, make me a play day. How you doing, Blue? I send mine's girl, as always. My respects to you. Uh, chili better than flour tortillas. Yes, sir. Audio's good. We're in the hood. You guys see what I got going on right here? I got the tomatillos. Oh, I'm already prepared. I got the jalapenos, the serranos, the wari, uh, the wario, and I got the garlic. And it's about to go down. Uh, good. We. <laughs> that's right. Yes. Yes, indeedy. I appreciate you so much, Blue. I appreciate everyone in here, man. I'm going to get the... um. The food and people could just rewind this. So <clears throat> what I'm about to do is I'm going to roast my shit while I'm getting down. So I'm going to put in the, um, the tomatillos, the jalapenos, and serranos, and the guayillo chili. Get it all in there. Garlic. Oh, man, this is going to be bomb. Get your garlic in there, and then I'm going to let it all roast up while we're chilling. Uh, audio is good. That's right, man. I appreciate you guys. We only got 19 people in the building, three likes. Turbo says, don't forget the coffee, brother. You already know I got the big old, big old botella of coffee. You know I got that, man. What's up with it, though? Let me turn this down so I don't want to get disturbed while I'm doing my thing. So what's up with it, man? What you guys into? You see, I'm cooking. Outdoors, outdoors and adventures, what fun do... What's there fun to do in San Jose? Oh, there's a lot of fun things to do, man. Go downtown San Jose, go chill, have a good time. Look at my stomach. It's getting flat. Um, and the only reason I'm doing this is because I promised the homegirl B that I would do this, man. So, you know, I got to, I got to do it right. So my sister-in-law told me, uh, told my niece to clean it up. She better clean it up. Tacoma, Washington is tapped in, man. What's happening with it? Man, everybody wants to be calling me at this point in time. Sorry, I'm live and I'm trying to get down. So I got the all the chiles and the tomatillos down. <clears throat> we'll start the meat in a minute. Dylan Rodriguez says, I've been waiting for this one. You see how the tortas blow me up? So you guys know I don't be lying. One phone going off over there. You just heard one phone in the beginning. They're on super blow-up status. Uh... That's right, Super Norte or Super Sureño. You seen that one? It was funny, bro. The Valto had a fucking, it looked like he his head was all greasy, so it looked like he just took some fucking three flower and just put it on and got to fucking doing his thing. So what's up, buddy? We got 40 in the middle. Make sure you guys hit those likes, man. I appreciate all the support. Thank you guys so much, man. Uh, we're doing what we does. Again, we're in the kitchen. I'm cooking. It's what I do. My daughter got all her chips right there. I got my protein powder because I'm trying to get nice and chopped up. I think I'm coming along just fine. I'm getting cut up. Um, and everything's good in the hood, man. So I appreciate you guys so much. What's up, Trev? I see you. How you doing, my brother? Shout out to Trev. Uh, when are you going to interview your cousin? Your stories about him are hella funny. You know, if I can convince him to come on, I definitely will. I love Captain Crunch. You see my Captain Crunch? That's my kid's Captain Crunch. Juanitas is the best. It's Kamai. Wayne Sweeney, Nicole Skelly. Hey, what's up, Nicole? I see you. Uh, that's right, Trev. I see you see Blue is in here, man. Good peoples, good peoples. Tommy T, I see you. So, yeah, I got my thing going on right now, Mr. Yasso. 
So if I'm not able to pay attention to every uh, comment like I usually do, the Spencer, Yo Gun, the Eclipse Day is coming, Sopas and Water on standby, Psh, like a motherfucker, man. You know I'm ready. Welcome to my kitchen. It's not the cleanest kitchen, but it's better than my tias. Uh, Yo Gun, that's right. Double R seven four five. I see you, man. We got the chiles down. They're cooking. Then, once the chili is already, I can make the sauce. Let me turn this on in the back over here. Then sauce. Because I'm about to put the, the carne down and get that hooked up. I already cut up everything. I pre-did everything. Turnbull, welcome to Bangers, man. I appreciate you. Thank you so much. Uh, if you guys haven't jumped on the membership, the membership is popping. Who was the best cook you had as a celly? Me. Juan? Nah, there was an OG, man. He was from Sacra. That about to got down, bro. He made wonders. He made miracles every Thanksgiving. Chile Verde spread. Now, fuck the spread, bro. Chile Verde tacos is what I'm going to make. I got some um, some queso fresa. I'm going to fucking look them up. Some aguacate. It's all good. I need to take notes. What are the chef gunners in the house? What's up, Raj? Nancy, I bet you're a great dad. I try, girl. I try. Hey, you can't be a, ba a, a great dad if you don't got Takis in the pad. <laughs> that's, the, that's the thing. What's up, James? I'll see you. What are the chef gunners? I appreciate all you guys, though. I'm sorry about the lighting. I didn't put my light in here to make it better, but who was the best fighter uh, you were with in Y? Uh, Soldier Boy from 6th Street, Stockton. Yeah, I'm good, Nancy. Orchids is hard or soft shell tacos. I think this time I'm going to go with uh, <clears throat> like street tacos. You know, I might even go flour tortillas and just make some beans on the side. I don't know what I'm going to do yet. I'm just trying to make this recipe uh, for the homegirl right here. So I got my... Uh, my tomatillos down, my jalapeno, my serranos, two cloves of garlic, and one guarillo chili roasting, because that gives it just a little bit, bit of a different kick. And that's what I'm on right now. Wait up. I'm not trying to turn my back on you guys or nothing like that, but, you know, I'm cooking here. Uh, <clears throat> Old man P. Diddy is currently a free man. Currently. You know, he's getting as much pipa as he can. At this point, Isaiah says, you've been watching any of the MLB games, G? Um, I have not, bro, to be honest with you. I was going to watch that Dodger-Giants uh, uh, game the other night, but I got sidetracked. You know, tortas, hey, torta duties. When they call, I got to stand tall. What's happening? Shout out to everyone. We got 66 in the building with 31 likes. I appreciate you guys. I know I went a little bit earlier. It's because I'm trying to knock this shit out. Tommy says, Diddy's son got accused of drugging females. I ain't surprised. The apple don't fall far from the tree, man. Usually when you have a, um, when your father's doing it like that and you've been spoiled your whole life, having it your way, then you think you could have it your way. And that's definitely not a good look. So trying to read this. What's up, Leche Compoyo? I see you, man. I send my respects. We got the chiles, the tomatillos and everything cooking. It's going to make the bombest chile verde. I'm telling you, <clears throat> I'm about to put the, um, the pork down. Let me get it. I chopped up and cubed up on my pork, so it's ready to go. Let me make sure I drain it. I don't want none of the riffraff shit. And when you're making chile verde, you want to brown the pork, but you want to do it in a pot because you don't want that chile to spill everywhere. So, bam, just get that popping right there. You got to put a little so way in it, huh? I like to do it in the reverse way. I'm different. I don't use the oil or none of that, man. I let the flavors do its cooking. That not a line. Just watch the watch the get down with the gun. There's women out there right now that are like, damn, I didn't know he got down like that. I do. And in that fashion. Garlic powder. Didn't get the notification bullshit out. They're not giving out notifications, huh? The night I do all this and they don't want notifications. Garlic powder. Um a little bit of salt. Just a little bit. You don't need much. A little silent. And then, of course, the black pepper. And we're about to get it to pop. And what's over my black pepper? Why is it acting funny? There we go. Bam. Let that cook. Mom's always told me, man, don't scrape your shit like, like my cousin's fat girl using a fork. 
B, what's up? Didn't get the notification. I'm here. I know. I don't think they sent notifications out because we only got 64 in the building. Usually by now we'd have over 100. But it's all good in the hood. I'm, uh, I got the meat down, B, with uh, the spices and the onion. Let that cook. I got my chinas roasting. They smell good. They sound good. It's all good in the hood. And I'll show you guys some close-up visuals when the shit's done. But we're going to get all that roasted up. And hooked up the ser I got four serranos, or excuse me, three serranos, four jalapenos. I got like 10 tomatillos because tomatillos are smaller, and one guarillo, guarillo chili, and then two cloves of garlic. That's going to make my sauce. Put it to Arby's, Wing Stokes, man, 177 Richie says, Getting down in the kitchen, I'm at work hungry as a motherfucker. Mr. Dick says, Thumbs up, guys, so we can push it out. Yeah, let's get them thumbs up, man. Let's push this shit out. I don't know why they didn't send out the um, they're hating on your boy, they didn't send out the notification. Extra sauce that says, nice of you uh, to give your tortas the day off. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? They can rely. They were blowing me up already. It's dinner time. It's dinner time. Uh, Minister of Darkness is looking at, looking like my kitchen, bro, minus a torta. Michelle, there she is. She says, what you cooking for me on my birthday? Happy birthday, Michelle. Happy birthday to you. I wish I can give you my present. But until then, we're going to put that one on hold, like in Vogue. Um, I'm making chili verde. No notifications tonight. I know gun smoke. They're playing your boy out of pocket. That's a hey, they wait till I'm doing something smooth and then it's the way hey, it's the way of the world. It's the way YouTube treats me. So we got to reverse it on them. We got to show some, some support. Hit them like buttons. We only got 44 likes, 77 people in here. Let's get it, man. People will watch it on the replay. So I appreciate that fact. And what are you guys thinking about the um the Super Norteño videos? You like them? Should I hit you guys with a part four tomorrow or wait? Nick has got two members now. Gun. Hey, that's right, Nick. I appreciate you, bro. Happy birthday, Michelle. Yes, it's my Michelle's birthday. Uh, mm, yummy. In your chummy. Yo, Cass says, if you hear a little noise, it's just me and my boys playing with our toys. M1, because everybody got to have fun under the sun. Under the sun. Under the sun. Give us part four. Fran and Bear. Hey, shout out to Fran. Funny as fuck, fool. <laughs> Mr. Dick says, shit, I was fucking. It was funny when you drank Southside Bear. Oh, yeah. Hey, it was bush beer. Nasty ass beer, but I was slamming it. And I thought it was fighting like this. <laughs> he was trying, he, was all, he thought he was all swollen as shit. Loved your video today. You seem real passionate about it. Thank you, B. I appreciate you. Part four for sure, says Nick. Adrian said, chili pulled pork fries cleaning. Yarda. That was Bob Gun by Ice Cube. Yeah, the Bob Gun. One nation. Under group, that's the jam. <clears throat> Food and Felons is in the house. He says, Rider Gang. What's up, Food and Felons? I'll see you. Uh, Michelle says, Thank you. Isaiah says, You should have someone come on and talk about the female prisons, homie, for all the women who watch your channel just in. Uh, all right, hey, you never know. Raiders Gang, my bad. I'll see you, my brother. How you doing, sir? It's been a minute. Uh, Raider gang, my bad, just had a beer. No pistol, never hurt nobody, bro. Uh, he was on the Chucky and uh, Midget documentary. Who was? Uh, Tim Cassie says, sub with gun, chili verde. Yeah, I'm making chili verde right now, bro. We got it going down. I'm cooking. Um, jalapeno, serranos, garlic, aguajillo chili, um, and tomatillos are in. I got the pork already cooking. The carne is down. We got to do what we got to do, man. I'm going to get down with it. My boy Anthony was tapped in the building, man. Tim Cassidy, Smoke Dog. Kamai says, I thought you wasn't a Raiders fan. Big says, Kamai, Smoke Dog says, Crook. Um, we in here, man. Uh, I just seen, seen some of that shit, and he turned into a Transformer. Oh, you're talking about that cop. He was a Compton PD. Uh, thanks to the guy who helped with the iPhone membership yesterday. Hey, that's right, man. Whoever helped Nick, thank you, man. We appreciate that. Still a gang all day, but gonna got a Raider hat. Uh, says food and felons. B says taking notes. All right, B. So it's for this is. I mean, this is just for me. So if you're making it for a lot of people, and I'm gonna make it for two days, you know. So I made four jalapenos, three serranos, two cloves of garlic. Uh, I think I got ten tomatillos. That's my base, right? One guajillo. How do you say guajillo pepper? Right. That motherfucker right there gives it that little smoky flavor. Of course, I'll show you the spices when I put it in the blender and do all that with the cilantro, the onion, um, 
the cava, the pollo, the shit I use, the special shit. I got the carne cubed up, which is just your basic pork, boneless. Because, you know, I mean, sometimes bones are good in Chile Verde, though. They give it that extra flavor. So you do what you do. Smoke Dogs does not check out Audio Tales, new episode. Oh, is he's talking? All right, I'll trip, I'll trip out on the smoke. Uh, we got 78 in the building with 52 likes. I highly appreciate all you guys. Man, thank you guys so much. Michelle, she said, I love the video of your primo. My side was hurting from laughing. I'm trying to get that other side hurting. Michelle, what's happening? I'm just fucking with you. Well, it was funny, huh? A happy birthday, Michelle, though. For those of you that don't know, let's wish her, let's wish her a happy birthday. Smoke Doss at Chile Verde over the pookie any day. You feel me? Spill a super Norfenio story on the quicks, says Fran. I got you tomorrow. I got a good one. Uh, yo, Gun, who taught you how to cook? Um, my abuelita, man, my grandmother. I would just watch her. My tias, they always were cooking. I was just interested. You look far bigger on my huge TV inside. Do I, Nick? Uh, Nicole says, what kind of papusas should I get? Ooh, wait. Uh, Henry says, sub Gunner, uh, ill cap. My Camry was 238,000 miles on it. I'm trying to get a milli for it. No, I'm just trying to get too much money. You're trying to get a mill out of it like Al Bundy? Al Bundy got a milli, huh? Happy birthday, says Isaiah. Davis says, yo, bro, you got skills. When are you doing the raffle? What time, says Dodgetown? We're going to do that um, next week, brother. It's going to be next week. It'll be about six time. Food of says, what's the cash app? Oh, you don't have to do that, brother. Well, I appreciate you, man. You don't have to do that. It's highly appreciated, though, man. You don't even know, man. Boucher says, New Mexico hatch green chiles. Happy birthday, Michelle Gutierrez. But I'm going to put the cash app, though, just in case if anyone does want to do that. But you don't have to, you know. But, I mean, the meat wasn't cheap. I don't get food stamps. Let me see. Um, she does, though. If I could put it. Uh, let me see. Nicole says, you didn't answer which ones. I'm not sure. I don't really eat papusas. Uh, Nicole, to be honest with you, that's never been my thing. My boy David is looking all on top of my refrigerator. He sees my daughter's Captain Crunch. 15 rounds. Um, we want to hear more Thea tales. Oh, don't trip. Tomorrow's a bomb one. It's going to involve my Thea like to the utmost. Send you some money tomorrow, brother. No, nah, don't worry, B. I'm just fucking around. I don't need many blessings is all I need. And a happy birthday for Michelle. And we're good. And everything's good in the hood. I appreciate you. Let me make sure I don't burn the chile. Hmm. You know, we got some shit popping right here, man. What do we got popping? Oh, wait, look at that. Look at that. Oh, wait, if I could show you. I'd do it if I knew you and I know you. Oh, that shit looks bomb. The cheese, the, the meat's looking good. You want to get your, uh, it's because it's pork, you want to get it browned up real good. Uh, I'll just get steak, says Nicole. Steak sounds bomb. You can't go wrong with steak, girl. Happy birthday, bro. How old are you? Uh, it's not my birthday. It's Michelle's birthday. And we don't ask a woman her age. Chicharron con queso go crazy, says LZ. Adrian says, huelga. The huelga. I used to have a big-ass huelga bird right here. Um, but I put raza real big. I had Merced with the huelga bird. And... um. It was the old, you know, old shit. When I was younger, I got it. So it didn't come out the way I wanted it. So now I got raza, but it's still not done. Que pupusas, lo roco con queso, or ramas con queso. Danny, they they put an ad, they, they put an ads on my life. Yes. Rajas says Michelle. Um, happy birthday to Michelle. Though. What's up with you guys, man? Thank you guys so much, man, for tapping in. We got 114 in the building, 63 likes. Let's get those likes up to 100. I'm making chile better than homemade gunner style. Um, I keep my promises. P-Funk is in the house. He says, guard. And tomorrow, part four is coming up. You guys already know how I do it. I do a more serious topic in the morning, um, a little bit of comedy in the afternoon. Hey, what's up, Julian? I see you. 15 rounds. What's happening with it? Ah. Damn, your boy looks good right there. Angelica says, hey, Gunners. Yeah, we're getting down with some chile better than. Let's see what you're working with. So... I'm roasting on my chiles right now. I don't know if you guys can see those real good, but everything's going down. The tomatillos, the chiles, the garlic, everything's getting roasted. So that way when I put it in the blender with a little bit of caldo de pollo, a little bit of salt, 
um, a little bit of cilantro, some limon, um, and of course, a little bit of more garlic powder, a few little things we can get it popping. You got to go premium to be ad free. Let them know, 177 Richie. Ruben Aquino says, bro, I started here what I'm eating today with the homemade tortillas. Tim Cassidy, hey, I appreciate you, brother. Thank you so much. Ill Cat says, have you been doing mocking on burpees? Just push ups. Why? Do I look good or do I look all sucked up? My primo, hey, my primo said, hey, for you to call sucked up. Well, why? I said, you want me with a fat stomach like your old lady? I always like big women. It's, but I'm not a woman. I know, but at the same time, you're a dropout, though. <laughs> it was a trip. Cooking with the gun, man. Angelica says, so you don't boil your tomates first? No, I don't. I roast them. I roast them, and right before everything's done being roasted, Angelica, I'll put a top on it and let the steam soften them up. That's just the way I was taught. You could do it several different ways. Should I have a fucking homeboy that gets the cans? You know the can ones, the Juanita cans, the fucking tomatillos in there. Just put them in there and just fucking blend it. Yeah, I'm good with that. Henry Caballero says saludos from the national, uh, from the nation's capital, D.C. Yeah, I got a primo that lives out there, bro. I do. Isaiah says stomach tats ain't no joke, huh? Shit, bro. Look at all that. Look at all that work. See that shit? That shit ain't no joke, bro. Gunsmoke, congrats. How did it go? Says Orchid J. Ruben says, that's why my torta is making me today for my birthday, the big four six. Hey, happy birthday, Ruben, to you and Michelle. You know, it's your birthday. Chili verde pork tamales are the best, though. I like the chili verde uh, chicken, but um, the pork or bomb test when I'm making pork right here. Shit looks like it hurt like a motherfucker. Do you put water when you blend it all? Ah, a little bit, just a little bit, because I like my um my better to be a little bit thicker. Because it cooks down into the carne. I don't like it real wet. Mob Life says, I'm going to watch this while I smack this fettuccine. Ooh, like Luciano. Steam, soften them up. Knowledge you can't get in college. That's right, Minister of Darkness. You know, you got to be on point. You got to stay on point so you don't got to get on point. Because that shit hurts. Like and subscribe. That's right, man. We got 112 in the building. 75 likes. Let's get them likes up to 100. Thank you guys for all the support. I'm here trying to cook for you. Just a Chicano. And his kitchen, uh, that Captain Crunch is calling me. That's just the, that's the late night when the kids are asleep and they don't know. I, I smoke it, boom, smoke that whole box. The top of the head hurts to get tatted. Um, I don't got the top of the head, yo cat. I got the sides and the back. You like it wet? Real wet, Michelle. But I I know I can always keep you like that. Gunner, do you mess with an Instapot or air fryer? I like the air fryer and the Instapot. I got both, bro. Uh. I'm a other, but enjoy your channel, boss. Hey, thank you, man. I appreciate it. Shout out to the others, man. The others car. I got definitely got a lot of love for you guys, man. Don't be jealous, gun. Have you ever tried the Chile Verde burritos from Fortunas and Livas? Does a bear fucking uh, uh, use a fucking cocktail's fucking toilet paper in the woods? Absolutely, bro. But the Chile Verde burritos at Casita and Merced are better. We thanking the man upstairs for Gunsmoke's job. He's going to be making bank. My boy Gunsmoke is going to be papered up. Manny, sorry, no tortillas. Uh, Tim, Nicole says that place is closed. I'm just going to come over and eat with you. Just come on, girl. We'll do the fire, the fire, the fire. <laughs> hey, Mallory the Duck, what's up, bro? He says, Gunner, your super North Fender stories are epic. God bless you, brother. Hey, thank you so much, man. Mallard, I appreciate that, bro. You didn't have to. But thank you, man. It went smooth. Back in the days when I was young, I'm not a kid anymore. I don't want to burn my chili. You can't go wrong with roasting them, though. You want that black char on your chiles. You want them. Um, you want them to have that char. That char. I see people scrape it off. I don't understand why they roast them and scrape it off. To me, it's always been the best to keep it like that. Let me make sure the carne is good. About halfway, when your carne starts to whiten up, is when you want to drain it, drain the excess juices out of it, so that it gets a nice brown crisp to it, and then. You're going to hit it with the chile and just let it marinate for about 45 minutes. So um, if, if this is not done by the time we're done with the live, I will make my plate and I will post it as a short so you guys can go and see the finished product. But you never know. She cooks fast. so And we barely got on here. Stop because I really will, says Nicole. And I really will come through, girl. And we'll really chill for reals. Add garlic. Garlic's already in. It's roasting right now. I roast the garlic as well, Vic. Mob Life says the homie got all the seasonings. Like you got, oh, I got all the seasonings, bro. I really does this. I'm really that one. I'm a certified. I was in the high power of Tory Lanes. 
You know what I mean? I'm a certified step in the kitchen. I am him. I am that one. I am LA's. Well, wait up. I'm not from LA. <laughs> Big Chavez says, that's right. You cooking the you cooking the ops. Hey, what's up, Ask Bum? Minister of Darkness is Gunner's next lesson. How to plate a perfect torta or how to pull one. Add some torta sauce. Shit. We just might have to go that route. What's up with it though? Isaiah says guns is a super chef. Where's your torta at work? It's not it's not the length or the weight, it's the way she works it. Big Chavez says beats spreads. Um, I live alone though. I don't have a torta that's in-house. See, I don't need in-house mostly. It's always one phone call away. So, yeah, I like to keep them spread out so that they don't inner beef or inner pork or however that goes. Beat spreads, get no big, you know, fucking way better, bro. Oakland ain't got no teams no more. Why? Who left? Did the A's leave or what? Let me drain this uh, out of here real quick. Because we don't want to, um, all that whole, the juice, you know, we don't want to go that route. So, let me drain it, make sure everything's good. Excuse me, ladies and gentlemen, but I'll be back at it like a snack addict in a minute. Okay, there we go. And then cheetahs are cooking good. So at, at this point, oh yeah, they're roasting. That's that's roasting. So now I'm gonna grab my lid. I'm gonna hit him with my lid real fast. Let me pop the top. And let it low right. Uh, that's right. I appreciate your positive vibes, bro. Thank you for uh, being you. Hey, thank you, Big Chavez. I appreciate you. B says no disrespect. Just kidding. Why? What happened, B? Uh, Jackie. Okay, Papi. I see you. What's up, Jackie? I see you. We got Jackie. We got Michelle. We got Nicole. We got Fire. We got. <laughs> uh, let me get a bowl of Captain Crunch. That's just bomb up. You got to bring Super Norteño on the channel. Gavato come in here like, hey, what are you cooking, eh? They walk like this, too. They always watch front and back, like like if he's dancing or something. What's up, fool? <laughs> I swear to you guys. Hey, he he held up. He doesn't have a Mongolian anymore, just so you know. It's a shag now. Yeah, he let the Mongolian go. It was He held on to that motherfucker until they... So the homeboys literally told him, hey, we're not supposed to have those anymore. He said, I don't give a fuck. It's North. If I'm willing to go, I'm willing to do whatever I got to do. They're like, we're going to remove you. He said, All right, how, do, how do I cut it off? Just do it right here. <laughs> you know what I mean? Uh, the red crunch berries are the best. Michelle says, Sharon is caring. Nah, Michelle. Uh-uh. Yeah, I can't do that. More earth, wind, and fire. It's all of our life. What's happening with it, though? Man, I appreciate everyone that's in here. Again, if you can see it steaming up. So those will be ready to go. The carne is cooking. And then so when I make the sauce, I do it in a blender. I'll dump all the ingredients from this pot into my blender. I'll put a little cilantro, a little bit more salt, um, the rest of this fresh onion, a little bit more lime juice, some caldo de pollo. You got to use a little bit of caldo de pollo. That's the trick. And it's ready to go. Man, wait. So did he fall off too or is he still? No, he's active. No, he's active, Isaiah. He's still, he's still in good standings, bro. He's one of those homeboys, bro, that they just, how can he fall off? He fell off when he was born. Like, he fell off into some bullshit. Making dinner, the shower, the work. That's right. I think I like Michelle, says Tim Cassidy. You think, he, yeah, yeah, uh-huh. Ask Michelle who she likes. Caleb says, what's up, everybody? Ask a bum says, you see what I said? I did it, ask a bum. Wes Watson once hooked a cop car and used it to drive out of the prison without being questioned. The author was just rolling like this. They see me rolling. They're hating. All you see was fucking Will sticking out of his asshole. You're correct. That ill cat, Barry Crunch. Uh, J.R. Silent Bob says, I have been loving those videos. Can't wait for the fourth. I got you on the fourth, the fifth, and the sixth, man. As long as you guys keep liking them, I'm going to keep dropping them because me and that guy went on adventures. The one I got tomorrow, though, it's just it's off the hook. They're just going to get better, better, and better. Um, I'm demolishing uh, the Carousel Mall in San Bernardino. Oh, they're demolishing it? Mob Life said, hey, what's that white powder in that tied-off baggie in the corner? Probably Coke. <laughs> Mob Life. I, I don't know shit. I don't know. My primo was here last night. What's up, my bro? Hey, what's up, Ricardo? Uh, Ricardo, I see you. Minister of Darkness says, it's Michelle's birthday. Yes, it is. Vic Chavez says, remember the shooting back in the 90s on, outside the mall? Uh, B 
says you're the best. Thank you for this. Gun smoke's gonna appreciate it. Oh, absolutely. Make sure it be and you go back and watch it if you missed any of it. Uh drop one on your Thea tomorrow, bro. We got one with uh that involves my Thea heavily, literally, heavily, right? So make sure that you tune in for that. You know about you know what time I drop them, usually about 11 30, 12. Um, we got 127 in the building. We ain't got 100 likes yet, though. So let's get up to 100 likes, man. Fuck with your boy one time. I appreciate it. Um, oh, wait. See that steam? See that steam? I, I told you. I know what I'm doing. I, be, I does this shit. Oh, my God. Let me turn that up a little bit. Get that carne cooking good, man. You want to you wanna get it browned. You know you from the hood when you keep the spices under the nightlight. Yes, that's hood shit. It's all good shit. They didn't just make this ledge for nothing, bro. You know, it's for something. You know your hood when you ain't got a cap on your shit? Or you know your hood when you ain't got a fucking, when your stove's white and you ain't got a, yeah, no stainless steel in here, only my knife. Uh, put some flour in it, gun. What's up, gun? That chili verde ain't looking right, my boy. The chili verde ain't, ain't done yet. What does that say? Give it a second or two. You know, it's like a torta. Her shit might not look right, but it's game tight. You just never know until you enter if you could find the hole. I've told you stories where I couldn't sometimes. What's up, bro? Drinking some cafe. That's right, man. David Lopez, I see you. Caleb says, uh, hell yeah, do your funny as fuck with your cuz. Vic Chavez says, what's up with Dubs? He just turned 50, man. Yeah, happy birthday to Dubs, man. Um, he's getting older, man. Bolder, but having the weight of the world on his shoulders. Michelle says, that's what I wanted to hear. I don't like to share either. No, we can't do that, Michelle. You already know what it is. Let him know. Let him know you're my cowgirl. Um, you should do some stories about the mush. Never been locked up in a place so unsecure. Tim, I used to. I used to escape every night from Sandy Mush, bro. They can't get me anymore. Statue of limitations. I used to do that shit, bro. Palabra. Hey, I could tell you guys crazy stories. No one would ever, ever believe me, but they're the fucking truth, man. You know your hood when you think it's a nightlight. Is that what I thought it was? Gunner, how did you learn to cook? Self-taught or someone taught you? Just looking at family, all my tias and, and my grandmother and all them, they all cook, my mom, everyone. So I would just, just peep it out and then add my own twist. You know your hood when you got the cereal on the fridge. Exactly. Orderly Gun, what's good? You got some funny shit with Super Primo. I think we can do more super stories. Oh, we're going we're gonna to keep the shit rolling. God's child says, if we got to meet, we could cook off. That'd be a good one. Why is Texas Mexican food is different from Cali Mexican food? Um, look, at, shout out to Texas. I'm going to tell you right now, I got a number love for Texas. In fact, there's some chick that she might be from Denver. She might be from Texas. So I don't know. I'm trying to get in the middle, right? Um, but I'll tell you guys the truth and facts. Texas, they've always separated themselves from and, and done their own thing. So they just got their own estilo. Did you ever meet my brother up north, last name Ledesma? I don't know, Vic. Quite possibly, bro. Uh, bro, I bet Wes Watson hooped his belongings when he paroled. How about the TV check? Super 8. Mm. In. Let's go. I was self-taught cook. Had to learn fast from my sister. Dylan says, you know your hood when your cabinet has no cabinet doors. Exactly. Hey, you know your hood when your fucking cabinet doors keep popping open and you think you have something stuck there, but it's really the roaches just opening them to go in and see what you got. What up? I'm not fresh off work. Where the tortas at? Texas tortas or Cali tortas? Um, I'm liking Texas at this point. I'm white as fuck and have my cereal mac and cheese on top. Not, not the mac and cheese on top of the refrigerator? Trying to keep it cold or what? Does CYA have SNY yards? No. There is no PC in CYA. And CYA, you're just going to get fucked and fucked up. And that's just what's going to happen. You know, if you're in bad standings, it's called being level. You're going to get beat up every day, every single day. Colorado Mexican food is better than Pennsylvania Mexican food. I would hope so, <laughs> Jay and Silent Bob. I bet your kitchen smells awesome right now. Oh, my God. We got that carne cooking. Looking bomb. Oh, my God. They're all steamed up, almost ready to go. Yes, it's smelling great in here. In fact, I have to cut on that fan. Um, I make my red chile homemade and green chile. That's what I'm doing. Homemade. Got uh, child. Texas tortas are bigger. I like a nice piece of French bread in the middle. No beans. Is there a way to make chile verde in the pinta? I mean, you can. They they sell um, so they sell like these roast beef. Uh, they're like uh, packs, right? And you take them. They're called Bushy Creek roast beef with with like uh, they have like a what's that called? 
uh, uh, uh. Like they have some shit all over them, bro. You take those, you wash it out. Hey, I appreciate that. I appreciate that, man. Appreciate that, food and fellas. Thank you, brother. It's been a minute, man. Thank you. 142 in the house, 112 likes. I know y'all can do better. Natalie, there she is. What's up, Mr. Greenfest? My boy is getting down. Usually we have a lot of people in here. Um, they didn't send out the notifications tonight. You know, they did, decided to do a Chicana U-turn on me. Pork rinds and some sauce from the chips. Yeah, Big Chavez, that's if you really want to get ghetto. But anyways, you take that Bushy Creek uh, meat, you wash it real good. Once you wash it real good, you put it in your hot pot with some butter, fry it up. Then you add, you know, a little bit of chicharron, some pork rinds, and uh, and then you hook it on up. You know, some sauce from the chips. Absolutely. Ever been with an, uh, uh, era, any Arizona tortas? I have. Tim Cassidy says it's kind of U-turn. That's right. So I'm going to move this over here. Okay. Hey, you know you're ghetto when you have fucking a, a caja right there. You know. you And you know it. So let me uh, let me plug this in. And it's going to get loud here for a minute, okay? But it just is what it is. But I'm going to show the girls, the ladies that want to learn exactly what it is so first i take the rest of my white onion look at b always use white onion don't go cheap and use that fucking yellow one or the the weird looking one use the white onion because it just has a better flavor and i'm not a big onion guy i don't like raw onion but i like the flavor of it i just don't like the crunch right that's me so you put your onion in the blender so you guys now listen let's, let's, let's blend some shit up i'm gonna show you guys right here my dirty ass blender don't mind me don't mind me, just try to rewind me. Then I take some cilantro. Oh, I love cilantro. Fresh cilantro. Mm, mm, mm. I take a bunch of it, throw it in there. There's my cilantro. Okay. So now we're going to switch this meat over to this one. And you guys want to see what all the, woo, what the chinas look like? There it is, everything roasted up. Okay? Keep the scene. Women, this is the only time you can get a fork. You gotta wash that shit first. Oh, I washed it all, brother. Yeah, I washed it all before I put it in here. Bam. I got my serranos. You understand me? Trip out on that. Get my tomatillos in there. They're, they should be nice. Look at see how soft they are? For Angelica. See the steam, how it steamed them? They're roasted and soft as fuck. They're bomb. You don't even need to add water to this because the juices from the, the tomatillos and the jalapenos will do what you do. And so, and for those that are saying, gun, you didn't use garlic. There's my roasted garlic. Put that in there. Everything roasted, man. I like roasted, not boiled. Absolutely. Roasted and steamed, man. That's the way to go. It just tastes better. You know, you make sure... You got everything ready to go. Oh, man. Them fucking tomatillas are roasted to perfection. Look at that. They're just falling apart. That's what you want. And then, of course, oh, my goodness. Right? Now, a little bit of salt. Michelle says, yes, Orchid A little bit of salt. You got to do that, right? A little bit of salt. A little onion powder or oh, wait up yep a little onion powder for the one time for the one time and then of course the secret ingredient wait up i got two of them because i'm mexican caldo de pollo now one thing about me is i don't um i don't measure i'm from prison i did prison time they didn't measure our time so i don't measure this shit right just put it in and it is what it is. Denise Castillo says, where's my wrench gun? What's up, Denise? It's been a minute, girl. I haven't seen you. This is a different channel, so. Now, with that being said, you're going to hit it with the last ingredient, which is going to be the lime, the lime juice. That juice combined with the juices already from the jalapenos and all that are going to do exactly what you need them to do. And the acidity of that lime with the, the tomatillos, Man, it all blends well together. It's going to get loud right here. Gente, despensa la tira. I'm going to pulse it. I'll pulse it. Uh, let me see. I 
I said hello when I popped in. Hey, I did. I'm sorry, Denise. I was cooking. <laughs> Just like that. Can you guys see the get down? Can you guys see the get down? You can see it right there. We're going to leave that right there in the blender for a second or two. I like to take a little bit more cilantro and throw it in my carne for flavor. You know, just because. Yolanda, that's right. Yep, I see it. That's right, damn it. Can you feel me? Let me put this in the refrigerator. The refrigerator is on stack status. And of course, when you make the tacos, if you don't have this, then don't even make tacos. Don't even do it. You know what it is. Okay, so we'll let the meat cook down. Sorry for your loss at Tim Cassidy. Uh, that's right, what's up, Jeff Loco? Hey, hi, Wisdom, man. What you making for? I'm making chile verde. Look, I made my sauce already right here. Let's get a close-up. You guys see that? Look at the consistency. Look at the consistency of it. It's perfect. It's what I does. Whipping in the kitchen with my guy, Tay-Tay. I see you, Nicole said, that looks so good. Can I taste test for you? Yeah, you can taste it. Definitely. Ray GHD says, you and Deprezi tool, uh, 20 I need to cook off. Uh, shit, I'll take that and a bag of chips. That shit right there will smack with some uh, papitas. Holy moly. That's right, Denise. One to ten. We need my boy Food and Fellas to do a, a food review on it. Maybe one of these days uh, I have to slide by and he can do a food review. Tim Cassie says, Natalie Smith, Michelle says, that looks delicioso. Mm, so do you. Happy birthday. Wu from Baker. What's up, Wu? What's up, brother? How you doing? Shit, you ever show tortas how to cook? You know, sometimes for their minds. Uh, what did it come out of? Joking brother, David Leon said, let's see the food. Oh, we're about to get down. I'm, I'm cooking the carne right now. It's pizza. So, I'm browning the meat. So, what happens with this is you want to brown the carne and get it real nice and brown. I'm making tacos, so I'm not going to do the arroz and the frijoles and all that. I'm just doing, damn, I look good right there for the ladies. I'll, I'll do the pose down for the lady. So, you just, um, you get the meat browned up once you do that boom i'm gonna make tacos little queso fresa little um avocate and then i'm gonna smack it with some cilantro on top like that you still on bro i'm making dinner what's up jc i'm making dinner too funk lover what's up brother i got um i put a blunt tortilla i put a burnt tortilla in mine to get a darker look and different taste yeah you could do that but i, I like to that's why i use the guarillo pepper bro because that that gives it that that kick and that taste come the flaco mr soto hey I am thin, bro. Remember when I used to have a big fat stomach when I fought Cholo Trucker? Now look. Shout for the ladies. Denise says, not lying. The way you done did that chile, you already a step ahead. Hey, Denise, why don't you boil it and do it? I don't do all that. So I, let it do it. I let it do what it do, Key. What's the seasonings? Garlic powder, onion powder, caldo de pollo, um, cilantro, uh, roasted garlic, fresh white onion, one guajillo pepper, three serranos, four uh, jalapenos, um, ten tomatillos, and that's and that's what I does. And then uh, a lime, a uh, half a lime. Healthy meal. Diacho was entered the building. It hey, was up, D. Charlie boil. Hell nah. Let him know, Denise. How nah, we get down? Never boil. Boiling kills the flavoring in it, and it takes out all the vitamins. Let it steam. Did you watch the show this full? Yeah, I got a couple partners of mine that were actually in that show. Um, Sonny Acosta was in that show, man. Shout out to Sonny. The streets ain't loyal. He was in that show. And another one of the partners, man. Who said measure? I don't measure either. The only thing that ever was measured on my body was my feet And she said, okay, it, it, it's up to par. So the Sir Dino laughed. <laughs> What's up, Frank? Jeb Locus has got to keep them uh, torta satisfied. I was going to do a live video, but I'm going to stay I'm going to stay at yours. Hey, JC, I appreciate you, bro. I got to tap into your lives, bro. I got to tap it. There he is. What's up, Christian? I appreciate you coming out. What part of Washington do you do any meats? I'd be badass to chop it up. You got a lot of badass glitch. Gracias, Gunner. 
Um, I'm in the Tri City area, close, bro. Uh, hit me up on TikTok, bro. Christian. Uh, damn, you fit. What's your secret? I got a pooch. I need to get rid of. Um, push-ups. That's all I do. Just push-ups. Uh, do you use chile de arbol? I do. I do, but I did it this time, man. Just so you know, I don't lie, right? You know what I mean? El guapo. Um, but I did it this time because I'm going for a little bit of a different flavor. Spence on Latira, Eastside Player, Mob Life says, I'm in the kitchen with the bulletproof apron on. I don't have much new uh, to YouTube. Natalie is in here. Deporte Perspective says, no burpees, G? Nah, bro. I done did millions of burpees in my lifetime. I don't think I need them, bro. You know what I mean? I'm already where I need to be. You know, with this diabetes and shit, I'm just trying to stay fit. I'm not trying to go for the fucking... I don't need, you know, the stamina. I'll just shoot you, bro. I don't, you know, it's just different for me. So now the carne is getting nice and brown where I want it to be. And now about another couple minutes right there, that'd be ready to go. I'll dump the salsa in there, the chile, and then I let it, I put it on low and just let it boil for about, you want to let it boil for, I'd say, a good 45 minutes. And then to the meat is tender, it's just falling apart, and then you're good. That's right, Michelle. Um, stay away from propaganda, says AJ. Yummy yum, says JC. Uh, and we out here trying to get some Captain Crunch with no berries. Um, I like the eight. Hey, the only thing about Captain Crunch is it fucks up your mouth, man. It'll tear your shit up. SC, you should make some chicken wings. Nah, nah we'll leave that to your fucking uh, boss. He's the master of chicken wings. Homes. Burpees, very little for me. I mean, I'll do some kickouts. I do more Navy SEALs than anything if I'm going to do something like that. Um, but all that fucking 22 counts and eight counts, and I'm not, I'm good off all that, bro. I did all that for years and years and years. You know, that's like part of being a Norteño, Mongolian, check. 122 counts, check. Red belt, check. You know, I did that. Raiders, Giants, Cam seem to beat the Dodgers, but it is what it is. You know, D, that's the curse right there, man. Okay, so that garden is looking good. It's about time. So I'm going to dump in the salsa. Here we go. Look. Oh, my goodness. No, he did it. No, he did it, right? I'm going to turn it to about medium low or medium high. A little bit of water just to wash this out. You don't want to put too much water in it. And, uh. I got dishes to wash and all kinds of shit. And then I want to mix it up. I'm going to give you guys a close-up visual right now, just so you know how I get down. So you know that the gun is for reals in, in real life. So, I'm going to take you guys over, over to the kitchen. Don't make fun of my stove because the torta didn't come clean it. Can you guys see that? Yes, indeedy. That's what we're on right now. Fuck yeah, I'm from Crosser, bro. I'll make one. I'm in Nevada working meanwhile the past two years. All right, Christian. I'll see you. i see where we at. Uh, let me see. Let me plug this back in, Hampton, before we get cut off. D says, Charles Woodson, the only jersey I would buy besides Bo Jack. Yeah, Bo Jackson goes. I got the Bo Jackson jersey. I just haven't worn it yet because it's signed. Looks young and hot. Yolanda is perfect. So we're going to turn that down to low. And then we're going to hit it with the lid. And 45 minutes later, tacos. Gunner Ramsey. That's right, Gun. Put it in work in the cocina. Yes, sir. AC Bar. Shout out, Matthew Salas. Um, the fun lover says, fucking banks. And the dude Johnny always talk about you. I said they won't say it to your face. Uh, I don't. Funk lover. Trip out on this, bro. I don't give a fuck who talks about me. I talk about money and about women. I don't talk about men. Do you have a guacamole recipe? Absolutely. Gapri. Absolutely. Biscuits, gravy, sausage, eggs, hash browns, SOS shit on shingles. Oh, I, I can make all that too. That's bomb. Um, Can't wait to make it. Bonos chili verde. Chili verde hits with sour cream. It does on the tacos. It does. A little bit of avocado, though, cilantro, and it just hits different. Um, I always hear Norteños don't like white boys, but I have a, a white men. Tim? But I have a gang of friends that claim red. What was your point of view? Um, you know, 
there's been a lot of uh, guerra, a lot of war fought in the California prison systems between Northerners and, and whites. I'm going to tell you right now, bro, we got along just fine. I, I had a lot of respect for the, the white men because they're with the business. But even on the streets, man, a lot of, you know, I'm, I'm from the Central Valley. There's a lot of white guys right there. So we were always cool. You know, we understood we had to stick with our own people and do what we had to do when we we're incarcerated. But that's just part of the game. Moms. Was that the Daha, Diet Baja Blast? No, this is the um the Mountain Dew um Zero. Zero sugar, bro. I'm diabetic. Uh, but I do. I have the Baja Blast Zero Sugar in there right now, too. I bought it today. I had some mole, arroz, y frijoles. Oh, shit. Michelle, are you going to cook for me, baby? Or what? Looks fire, says Tim. Salty Riders says Captain Crunch. So send me the Addy and I'll be there. I will clean your stove for some chile verde. Mm. We, won't, we wouldn't even make it to the chile verde. I'm telling you right now, off the top. It wouldn't be better there. It'd be better gone. And Southside Woods and NS Woods program different. Let them know, P-Funk. Brother, coffee. JC said I had tacos last night. It was a trip, though. I was going to go to jail. I thought I was going to go to jail. I'm glad I didn't go down. Pulled up, shit, uh, shifted real fast. Shit could go just like that, bro, one way or the other. S said, how was your first experience hooping paperwork? Damn. Well, that's a great, great question to ask while I'm cooking pork cop. Um, I mean, it was what it was, bro. I didn't fight the Philly. You know what I'm saying? Like a two short song. The homies were like, hey, bro, this is what we do. And then I just had to do that. I hey, thank you, Food and Friends. I appreciate that, man. Um, yeah, I just had to do what I had to do, man. I just, I ain't even gonna lie, I tried to cheek it. And the homie said, that's not the way we do it. I said, fuck, right? Um, you know, it's just not something I like, I'd rather discuss. Like Wes Watson, he gets all into it. You know, it's just part of the life, bro. You know, there's not a motherfucker that hit a four yard that can't tell you he didn't hoop no shit unless he was in the feds. Feds are different from the state. Federal prison, they, they're not obligated or mandated to do certain things where in the state you are and vice versa. There's things in the feds that in the state you're not mandated to do. So it works, you know, different ways. But I don't see a coffee pot. I'm highly concerned, brother, and you never will because I don't drink that type of coffee. I drink instant if I'm going to drink it. I don't really like coffee, bro, but if I'm going to do it, it's going to be pinta style, straight instant. Gotta do what you gotta do, says Tim. Exactly, Tim. Let him know. It's um it's part of the game. Shoot the 128G, says Pete Funk. Hey, hey, fucking West got his hooped all the time when he could just carry it in his hand. Ain't that a trip, Pete Funk? Now, Pete Funk, you seem like you're well versed in prison, so you know what time it is, bro. Just saying that. Um, tell the truth, Canal. Brother, do you have to hoop your 128G wherever you go as a white man, or can you just fucking carry it? <laughs> Put it in your property. It'll get there when you get there, you know. Why would you hoop it unless you're going to fucking the shoe or something like that, which uh, um, West Watts has never been to, you know, on a one yard CCF says Pete Fun shooting flags on the Yarda. Adrian Michelle says, I'll cook for you and then we'll have dessert. Mm, that's a date. Michelle, you already know. Zombie says, hey, homie, I made pot roast in a crock pot. I put it on and went to work. Now it's ready to eat eight hours later. Hey, that's the bomb zombie. You came home. It was smelling bomb, huh? I love that, bro. We should do that at my job. And me and my boss, because, well, I had one boss. He was the plant manager at the time. I was lead uh, foreman. And we used to do that. Put a, Got it in the crock pot. And then just absolutely food. Um, wouldn't make it to the Chile Verde. Where are we going? Ooh, we keep on walking, keep on talking. CC Peniston. Uh, uh, you ready for WrestleMania? Yeah. Hey, I'm so ready for WrestleMania. I got babysitters for my kids. I don't want to be disturbed. WrestleMania time, all weekend long. I'm a Southsider and still don't do that shit. My boy, oh, P-Funk, I already know, brother. I already know. I mean, just, I don't think anyone has to do that. We need to have a cookout live gun. We might just have to do that. We get on the grill. Um, I see unthrowing down. I see throwing down in the kitchen. That's what's up. That's right, Jesus. Natalie says, hit that like button while it's still available. I appreciate you, Natalie. Thank you so much, man. Uh, Nathan, what's up, brother? More cooking videos, dog. Beachwood, shout out to Beachwood, man. Uh, Tim says, gun is a play. Yo, all these women are about it. Tim, just call me Master P. I know they about it, about it. They know I'm right around. <laughs> I just fuck with it, though. But no, nah, me and Michelle, you know, she knows what it is. Do you let the carne get to room temperature? Um, do you let the carne get to room temperature before you dry? No. No. Yeah, I'm not. I don't do the Chef Ramsay shit. I just just cook it, bro. Michelle is absolutely stunning. I'm no competition, says Nicole. Why aren't you, Nicole? Hey, 
I, hey, you know what the most sexiest thing about a woman? A confident woman. Always be confident. Always. I got my mustard check and my pineapple ribs to put on the grill. Ooh, wait, food's doing its thing. The funk lover says most of the Northanians I met were mostly all white boys. That's it. Which was always a trip, eh? <laughs> a trip out. Um, those are probably just the ones you met. Because uh, I can show you a picture right now. You want to see a picture of some of my homeboy back in the days on the yard? I'll show you right now. Watch out. Mm -hmm. Look. Let me cover this. There you go, fuck. See some of the homies right there. You know, it's just it's just what it is. They're not all white, bro. I um, ain't nothing wrong with a, with a white man, though, man. Nicole, never say that you're beautiful, queen, says Michelle. D says, have you ever taken a uh, uh, Seroquil? Wait, Peel County, make you take one after I witnessed my homeboy pass out in front of me? No, nah, I've never took one of those. We are all beautiful. Let her know, B. Uh, Nicole says, I'm confident, but I know an absolutely stunning 10-10 when I see one, and I can't compete with them. I'm Ba -da -ba 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 -ba. I'm trying to get tens out of tens, dime pieces around this camp. I'll take a nine and a half though on the late night. There's a lot of white north. This is JC. There absolutely is, man. There's black, white, brown, Asian, Uso. Yo, gun, is it true you had your elote shot off? I don't know. I could pull it out right here and just swing it, Ricky. Um, I don't know. You want me to put chamoy on it? Gunner, ever eat alligator or any weird, unsafe, uh, unusual meals? I ate alligator jerky, man, just a couple weeks ago. Um, I went to uh, the beach and and uh, I went to a little novelty shop and got some alligator jerky. It's too gamey for me. Too gamey. Um, I bake buffalo steaks, things like that. Sick ass fools. Order the Pelican Gym. Uh, Michelle, you are the sweetest. Thank you. Beautiful. I just told the torta a little too something. I'm trying to do something at Wally World, <laughs> my boy. You ever had frog feet? I ain't never had no frog. I had frog legs. I ain't never had frog feet. Um, the frog legs, when I was little, they were good just because I was hungry. But as I got older, I was like, ah, maybe it was just the way they made them. Shit, alligator and frog legs, good. Then a motherfucker says, my boy Jesus. Tim says, I just calls it. How's I seize it? Michelle says, my pleasure, girl. Uh, I had frog in Cambodia. Tastes like chicken. Hey, Kamai, I remember it faintly tasting like chicken back in the days when I was little. But when I got older, I think they just, where I went, they just fucked it up. Oh, my God. That's looking so bomb. You want it on uh, low, medium. So, like, in between low and medium. Eating gunners, eating torta tacos. I can't do it. Says food. Since I'm starting my YouTube, I'm going to probably catch some negativity from some. Hey, it, it goes with the territory, JC. Not everyone's going to agree. You could agree to disagree sometimes. Um, what you have to do is stick to your script. Be yourself, bro, and understand, bro, just because you may not see eye to eye with someone at that particular time, a real one recognizes a real one, and you just you keep your shit to your chest and you keep pushing, man, doing you. Um, never air out dirty laundry. Never do bullshit like that, man. It's no one else's business. Sacred says, when I was younger, I would always eat pig feet from them jars. Ooh, wee, sacred intuition. The motherfucker's good or what? Gun, I need a hoodie. Zigzag, man. You need one of those, Avondale? Do you like those? The higher the socks, the downer the fool. My cousin is a fool, just like that, too. What's up, man? Damien Almares. David Aguirre says, what's good with it? Did I miss anything? Just me cooking a whole bunch of chili verde, bro. You be all right, though. You can always watch the replay. Um, the best jerky is the fresh slabs. Natalie, very true. We are all beautiful in our own unique ways. In my opinion, frog isn't worth it because it's mostly bone. Hardly any meat. No ditty. Exactly. You ever fuck with snails? Escargot. I've not, not yet, bro. I haven't had a chance to. I don't got. I don't got snail money. I ain't got snail money, bro. <laughs> you know, snail money hits differently. The high sock range war. I got that tatted on my uh, domes. The zigzag man. That's right. Avondale food offenses. Come on, you tried a lot of crazy food. I will say I've met a lot of different North Daniels, all different races, and from different walks of life. At the end of the day, they were all solid dudes and family men, but stay flamed up. D says, I ate dub and quail and golf. Hey, quail's bomb. I didn't like dub. Dub tastes like liver to me. Um, Quail's bomb. The pheasant and quail. Oh, man. Um, my stepdad used to make a pheasant's uh, uh, dumplings. Bomb. My grandpa lived on the ranch and made us eat what we shot. Exactly, man. That shit's bomb. They was fucking about respect, though. That's it. I remember the white homie from our hood. He was a baker's, needed a ride. So Northenos gave him a ride, and he respected the fuck out of that. That's right, bro. Yeah, you know, um, a Northenos always obligated himself, man, to um, aid aid any raza worthy of the cause. You know, 
Only out of the ordinary things, I've tried frog, alligator, and crickets. I ain't gonna lie though. I ate a couple grasshoppers. Come on, the motherfuckers taste like peanuts. Tim Cassidy says quail is fire as fuck. Quail's bomb. So is pheasant. Ducks, gotcha. Chingles of fat. Yeah, the ducks got a lot of fat. What about caviar, bro? You're you're way out of my price range, Dylan. I don't even know how to spell caviar. Mallard the duck says I grew up on welfare. Potted meat sandwiches and Miracle Whip. Woo! Damn, my boy Mallard the duck. Now that's real hood shit. That's that. That's that white white manhood shit. He said potted meat and Miracle Whip. That shit doesn't even sound good ever. Uh, but hey, I do the same thing, bro. Q ball says bird hunting. That's my department of love. Bird hunting, duck, geese, quail, pleasant, uh, pheasant, all of them. When I was little, my homie tricked me and I ate a roach, uh, a roach dipped in chocolate. Ooh, wee. Homies are scandalous, man. Uh, let me see. Wait up, let me let me text this board them real quick. Uh, out of my price range. Where's the sa uh, the Saxon and the Dobo? It's right there. I got all I got all the spices, man. You can't proclaim to cook if you ain't got the right shit to cook with. Have you ever heard of a Northenio turning Sureño or the other way around? Just wanted to know. Curious. I have, um, but in both cases, um, they ended up not being what they were supposed to be. In fact, the one the story I tell. All the time about Joker from San Leandro, he ended up getting incarcerated and being a Southerner, um, which blew my mind um, because he wasn't shit. You know, they wouldn't want him and we wouldn't want him. So who's your favorite wrestler? Ric Flair. Nowadays, it's Seth Rollins, bro. There was around 400 sued on the yard. I was the only Northerner. I was the only Northerner they actually respected. That's cool. Vatos. Yeah, JC, you know, um, hey, man, I have nothing bad to say about Southsiders, bro. They've always gave me a lot of respect incarcerated, like. Buenos Dias, bringing us ice, bringing us, giving us sopas. Hey, my neighbor was that one. He was that guy um, when I was at Susan Gone last in yard. And uh, he was from Sangra, the barrio Sangra. And he used to always, um, we trade CDs. He'd be like, hey, you guys going to bust down over there? Like, yeah, hey, bro, here's the Jeezy CD. We'd be bumping. They'd be bumping. He'd shoot sopas because we were in lockdown at that time. What are you eating your green chile with? I'm going to make a uh, chile verde tacos, Michelle. Yeah, I'm just going to make some, some tacos, real quick ones. I ate a torta and lodi once. It tastes kind of like a chicken, but more like fish. It smells like fish at least, huh? Did you watch the Bray Wyatt documentary? I haven't had a chance to sit down yet, uh, Ace, but I'm going to watch it, man. Hey, rest in peace, Bray, huh? 195 in the live, 160 likes. We got 200 in the live, 161 likes. Let's get it to popping, man. Let's get that Ric Flair impression. <laughs> like a Rick. Rick's a nut, huh? My cousin thinks he's Ric Flair, but a Mongolian. I just watched number three. I guess my cousin would beat his head against car trees or whatever when he was about to fight crazy. I see motherfuckers do that, bro. Get all stupid with it. I'm going to slide through with a couple chicks, bro. Put the table out. Let's, let's do it, mob life. Shit. Ain't nothing to it but to do it. We're going to get our mind right so we can shine right. High wisdom. No queso. Come on, brother. In that fashion. Uh, sorry, was playing PS5. That's right, Nick. Oh, yeah, Hector is coming out with a documentary soon, soon called Grunt. Hey, Hector's putting in that work, man. He's doing what he's supposed to do to build his channel. And his support base will continue to grow because he's doing, doing it right. You know, um, Hector's a good dude. We haven't had too much interaction, a chance to talk behind the scenes. But uh, thank you, Food. I appreciate that, man. Viva the Norteño CDC clerk, $50 a write-up. Ooh, wee. Damn, that's what's up. This is, that's what's up, homeboy. I need to learn some cooking for my son. Make sure that you watch the rewind on this, El Tony. Um, and that's, this is a bombest recipe, bro, period. I'm telling you right now, my shit, it hits different. What up, gun sock check, Arnan? Oh, I ain't even going to lie to you right now. I'll die with you. I got some ankle biters on. Check it. Let me grab that other phone, food. Damn, brother, like that. I appreciate that, man. Thank you. I appreciate you. Uh, shout out to New York. Hip hop exposed. Everyone trying to catch Gunner uh, slacking. Ain't going to happen. Gunner's got you covered. 
Oh, you know, Natalie, it's all good. It's all good. It's all fun and games. It's just not fun no more. I was playing Call of Duty. Hey, but thank you, Buddha Fellas. I appreciate you, brother. That's uh, phenomenal, bro. Thank you, man. Philip Chavez says, Chef Gun. I will, bro. I will, most definitely, bro. Um, Thank you. Uh, Gilly G says, what up, Gunner? What's up, Gilly G? I'll send mine, bro. Uh, High Wisdom says, where's the spread video? Um, I got a couple spread videos, High Wisdom. They're on the uh, channel. If they're not on this channel, they're on my other one, Gunner's Collective TV. Um, I've made chorizo spaghetti. I've made steak. I've made ribs. I've made uh, several different items, bro. Hip Hop Exposed says, would you go on No Jumper Gunner? Absolutely not. Absolutely not, bro. I ain't fucking with Adam 16. I don't like him. That's why it has nothing to do with his weird uh, accusations or nothing. I just don't like Adam. I just don't like him as a person. And I'm not a rapper, bro. There's no reason. There's nothing for me to talk about on this channel that I won't tell people on my own channel. You know what I mean? Yes, sir. Tim Cassie says, are you going to eat the chili better the tacos on live? Um, I don't know if everything's going to be done by that time. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put it on a, a short and show you guys exactly how it came out. Like and subscribe, y'all. Gunner keeps us entertaining, keeps it real. Thank you. Hip Hop Exposes Facts. Ewoks is good video. Kana. Had me cracking up with the hairnet. What's that? No jumper about I keep hearing. Um, It's a channel, bro. Some fucking weirdos. I, you know what, JC? I'm not going to sit here and wolf and hate on the dude because I don't I don't hate on him. I just don't like him, you know? Um, But tap into it, bro. If you want to support that channel, it's not a not a big deal, man. It's not like me and him have personal issues. I just don't like the way he treats um people of ethnic backgrounds, how he utilizes them, or they utilize themselves. He allows them the platform to utilize themselves. Cubo gun gun has that chili better than going G. Fire, bro. It's cooking, it's looking fire, homie. In fact, I gotta start it right now, just so we so we know what's up. But um, excuse me. Oh my goodness. Oh, you guys don't even know what's going on right here. But we're going to hit that lid and get it to popping. Natalie says he's not worth watching. No jumper. Need to just jump straight up. Uh, hey, what's up, though, man? Shout out to everyone. We got 180 in the building, 174 likes. Let's get it up to 200, man. I appreciate you guys. Thank you so much. Um, Tonight is that night. Adam going to be screaming, God, from the wood pile. Michelle says, what kind of cake do you like? Hey, I wish you were here so I can give you a cake, like real real life, because it's your birthday. Um, but my favorite kind of cake, to be honest with you, is the yellow cake with the chocolate frosting. Just the basic, the yellow cake with chocolate frosting. Soft white underbelly is sickening. I don't fuck with that dude whatsoever as well, Natalie. Um, how you could uh, exploit drug addicts is 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 crazy to me. You ever going to do something with food and funds again? Says Ace. One never knows does one. He's in here, bro. Um, He's in here, Ace. Uh, Steven says, I wish I could smell it. Do you show the whole recipe in the beginning? I absolutely do, Steven. I wish you could smell it. Uh, do you show the whole recipe? And you know what I'll do, bro, is I'll um, I'll make it so that way you guys know exactly what goes in there. But I, I show everything. I'm going to make nachos tonight, making me hungry. That's right, Nick. That sounds bomb, too. Hey, guns, did the taggers up north turn into hoods like they did in the south? in the 90s um <clears throat> different cities you know had different different things it wasn't like like in the south i see a lot it's all ran a tight ship in the north it's a little bit more spread out so each city run their runs their shit individually right so what we had going on in my town was there was some tiger crews there's still some tiger crews i guess um but i had a couple homeboys that flipped and, and they became uh, northerners and whatever but um i mean the tagging was just wasn't that serious it wasn't like real crews that were posing a threat like the Tigers out in L.A., they were with the shit, with the shenanigans, right? The ones up north in my city, I can't speak for other cities. Um, yeah, we just smoked all of them. Like, they didn't, they weren't doing that. They were just tagging. Um, they knew better to come in certain bottles and tag. And it just wasn't, it just never got that serious. But you got to understand, again, I was locked up from 91 all the way to the end of 96. So during that time, I missed that era. I was too busy in, in the youth authority. So it could have been, but I don't know about it. I'm going to bounce. Love and respect to all. See you soon. All right, Natalie. I appreciate you, girl, as always. My homie is originally from upstate. I he said that he was still talking to Norteños when it was a lot of beef. Like a lot of them are his homies. Even when the GUN album came out, he still talked to him. Oh, there's, you're always going to have people that you fuck with, man. Um, you're always going to have people that you fuck with. doesn't matter where they're from. 
Uh, I talk to a southerner every day. Every day. I talk to a bulldog every day. That's my word. That's my fucking word as a man. I talk to a southerner and a bulldog every single day. Okay? And it's because... Um, I don't know. We're all the same. Buenos dias, homes. Have a good night, bro. You know what I mean? Hey, how you doing this afternoon, brother? There's never no, hey, guess what, bro? This, this, and that, and this hood shit. No, we don't talk like that. It's just, hey, bro, we're doing good. Homies are doing great. And, and we and we stay up, up to par like that. Are you ready for WrestleMania? Who you got, Cody or Roman? <sighs> There's going to be some bamboozle shit going on. Ace, you know, of course I got Cody, right? And I don't even like Cody, but I got Cody just because I'm tired of Roman shit. But man, I don't know. It's gonna be it's WrestleMania, so anything could happen. I make a cake that's red devil's food. Uh, make condensed milk, a uh, caramel, and whipped cream. Ooh, wee, B. You might get me in the bake off. You might get me in the bake off. Peel folder, please. Blue flame is on. Adrian, a man respects me. I'll respect him one hundred percent. Absolutely, JC. That's what it's all about, bro. You can't preach respect and then not live by it. You know, you got to just respect everyone. You. You know how it is, man. Orchid says, I'm going to bounce as well. Need to lie down. Still recovering from oral surgery. Hey, all right, Orchid. I appreciate you, girl. You take care, and, and, and I'll drop that short when the food's done so everybody can see it. Yo, Hernandez Killer is in the woman's prison. Look it up. Chachilla, that punk. Um, Hernandez Killer. Who, who are you talking about? Sucker free? Ch and Chachilla, that women's prison is now a men's prison. Uh, I just order all my workout equipment. I'm about to get back in shape. That boy, Foodie Felons, is a hey, he be working out, running all the time. Are you going to do a live show on live WWE this weekend? We could do that, Nick, if that's what you want, bro. Just let me know. Buy it now. Have a good evening, girl. The fun lover said, Do you know anyone from the original gun album? Yeah. I knew the individual who got out of prison, bro, and initiated the gun album. Um, I know Dino, of course. I know Tokstero. Um, I know Mickey D. I know uh, Hurricane J. Um, I know several of those guys. You know that. Almost half of those people in that album are from my city, bro. They're from Merced. Uh, low Down, Dark Room Familia, all that. Uh, has an old military vet ever told you to take your hat? Take off your hat indoors. Yeah, it's because I'm bald, bro, and I haven't cut my hair. That's why. Look, I don't look bad, though. The girlies love me. Uh, what's up, Jose? Um, it's guns, not dubs. Uh, gun gun, can I take my 500 pound sister out on a date? Got not she cooks bomb. And since I get it, the length or the weight, it's the way she works it. I mean, if I could pick her up to put her in the car, then she could fit. Peace out, gun in the collective community. Got to cook something up for my daughter. All right, Tim, I appreciate you, bro. Uh, what did GUN stand for again? Generations of United Northenials. Oh my goodness, that shit is looking fantastic. That's you it right there. Sam Romero, hey, what's up, brother? I send mine, homie. I appreciate all you guys in here, man. Definitely. Thank you guys so much. Um, what's up, buddy? We got 184 in the building. Only 185 likes. If you fuck with the gun, man, let's go right now. If you haven't hit the like, just do me a favor. Hit the like right now. Let's get it to 200 at least. I appreciate it, man. That puts it in the algorithm. Um. Uh, thank you, man. Who's your favorite character from Blood In, Blood Out? Mine was Popeye and Crucito. Says, okay, Popeye, he like Chon Chon, huh? Crucito? I like Crucito, too. Um, I like Chewie, bro. Hey, it's John Wayne. Chewie was the shit, huh? And I'll take all the ones with no brawls on, right? Chewie's the shit. I was just typing that G-U-N stood for, and you said it. Yep, absolutely, JC. Is it pork or beef? It's pork. It's, uh... Chile Verde is with pork. I mean, you can make it with beef, too. It's got a different kind of a texture. I like it with pork. Um, if I'm making red chile, then I'm going to use beef, you know? Brian says, hey, gun, random question. Based on your life experience, how are Italians treated and viewed in the California prison or jail system? So you're going to see – there's no fucking Italians in East L.A. You're not going to see a lot of Italian men. Um, they run with the woods, okay? And if an Italian goes to prison, more than likely he's going to run wood. And he's going to kick it as with the white men. And they're treated with respect as long as they treat everyone else with respect. They got good cases. Um, they're not treated different based upon their ethnicity just because they're white men. So they're going to function with white men. What up? Some Chile Verde going down. 818 Southside. I see you, brother. How you doing, sir? Ruben says, hey, I was a high power. I was high power with Tory. I was high power with Tory Lanes. <laughs> the author was doing it. He was on one, huh? Dead homies. That author was like, hey, why did... Look at 
trip out on this. I come from an era that's different. We don't say dead homies. I love my, my homeboys that died. I don't even say, hey, I got dead homies. I said, I got homeboys that passed away, right? I respect them. You know, uh, how kids could just throw that around? Dead homies, dead homies. Hey, bro, I was born in a torta. She smelled like shit. Dead homies, dead homies. Like, damn, bro. You're going to put your dead homeboys in that fucking same sense as a, a smelly pussy? I don't get it. That's right, Leon, Junior Vizcaino. Saludos, carnal. Street Squeeze says, do you keep pots in the oven, homie? I see you have cereal on the fridge. Oh, I do. Come on, bro. I'm ghetto. You know how we do it. Yo, gun gun, you think Canelo's ducking Benavides? I do, bro. I hate to say it, but I said it, bro. Um, I don't know. And there's going to be someone that gets in here. He's not ducking. He has nothing to gain from it. Um, but he should stop boxing, period, if he has nothing to gain. He could gain $100 million. And, uh, and cement his legacy even more so than it is right now. And give that kid a chance, man. Win or lose, he's a winner. Canelo wins whether he wins or loses because he shows everyone he's he's down. Chili better than Super Burrito from the Taqueria sounds about, right? Blood sugar about to spike, says Javi. Yeah, absolutely, but that's why you take lip aside and it brings it down. <laughs> yes, sir, passed away 100%. Absolutely, JC. I don't get it, bro, these kids. Dead homies, bro. I'm making chili verde, dead homies. Like, damn, bro, you don't got to put it on your homies. Okay, yeah, we see it. You know, I just, I don't know. It's just a level of respect. Someone that does that uses the N-word, um, constantly saying dead homies on my mamas. Like, don't put shit on my mama, bro. My mama fuck around and hit you with the chunk line. Only dead homies I pull stuff on is Ben Franklin and Andrew Jackson. You feel me, bro? Ruben, you ain't lying. Uh, you eat radish with your tacos on the side. Arabanos? Yeah. I like a rabanos, the carrots, the jalapenos, all that, bro. Uh, Phillips says on gang gang. Yeah, they got to say it twice so that way you know. I used to put things on Norte. Yeah, street speed. Hey, I did that before, bro, until the homeboy did it. What? I said, on Norte, right? <laughs> He's like, on Norte, I'm about to stab you. I said, oh, well, then on Norte, I ain't going to say on Norte anymore. Uh, we can't defend Canelo anymore. No excuses for him to pass once again. Hey, what ace outside? I agree, my brother. I mean, there's only so many different ways we could defend him. I think we've ran out of, out of ways, bro. 203 on the likes. B, we did that. That's right. Mallard the Ducks says, we appreciate you, Gunner. I appreciate you more, sir. Yes, N-word is crazy nowadays. It's, it's went wild, man. The carrots are spicier than the jalapenos. That's right. Hey, me and Michelle, were, ooh, wait, I can't wait. Mo Vision, how's it going, Gunner? Rasa, the only ones that put the bread and the cereal on top of the fridge, huh? You see how he does it? Hey, and the aluminum foil. <laughs> that's old school shit uh hey i see the gun album Northside soldier is just like banging on wax uh north side soldier is not on the gun album bro that's on 17 reasons yeah that's uh that's a whole different album that's a gold toast produced album that came out in 97 called 17 reasons bro uh mousy i know mousy personally who uh did that song mousy i could tell you a story about mousy the guy who did that song north side soldier he got hit he got whacked, bro. Um, I don't want to speak on the specifics of what it was behind. It's just some scandalous ass shit. And um, he got his get backs because it was a bad call. WTP Niners, man, I messed up. Just bought some chalupas from Taco Bell. They were hella greasy. Ah, oh, bro, if you know how I'm living right now, there ain't a chalupa that can fuck with this. Facts. Michelle says Mexican-American, 100. You feel me, girl? Chicanos y Chicanos, raise up. Homie's going to do a drive. Bye, and we pull up like, hey, guy, that's right. Ruben says, San Francisco, I'm putting it down. Mousy dropped that shit home, boy. Shout. Young G's in the hood tried to come up. Quick to pull the trigger on the next man. He don't give a fuck. He on the mission trying to stack a grip. Red rag on his hip. And they glock with an extended clip. So just in case the funk jumps, got to keep a strap. Because nowadays, motherfuckers try to peel your cap. <laughs> that was the shit, huh? Rolling in the story, his intention to take a life. 19th and Plex again. Now he said, 19th and the Lex again. Bottles want to flex against some nasty buddies. Mom got to wear a black dress again. Hit the corner, yelled at Norte Puto. Then came the Glock, stuck out the window. Uh, we the Blacks also put the cereal on top of the fridge. I am the basis. Wait, 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 wait. Brothers do that too. <laughs> I tell you, man, black and brown. Cook crack, says Morty the Wap's on. Oh, I used to. I used to, bro. I used to do all that. He says, gang, you know, here with the little Hawaii. Oh, I, I know. I know the recipe. Uh, my bad, Gabriel Fernandez killer is in Chachilla, that punk. Oh, so he went that way? Sucker free? He was in Corcoran. Um, but remember, I told you guys, 
I dropped the spill that he got whacked in Corcoran or he got jumped on. Remember I told you? So they probably transferred him to Chachilla now. I told you, man, my, my shit be A1 from day one. Love you, bro. Thanks for the laughs. Hey, Lee. Hey, what's up, Lee? Mallard the Ducks is in the 80s. We were raised to respect everyone. Absolutely. Shout out. Like a torta with a snack cabinet. Gun going to make homegirls homemade tortillas. Not, not today, but I can. Woods do too. Counterclockwise. Let's see counterclockwise. Black and Brown Entertainment. Woods put it away. LOL in the pantry. Ah. Hey, I ain't going to lie. I had a wood homeboy that used to, true story, used to fucking make sandwiches with the Miracle Whip and then put it in the fucking cabinet, bro. I said, hey, that's supposed to go in the refrigerator. He said, no, we do it like that all the time. I said, that's why your breath smells like shit. <laughs> hey, what the fuck? Guns, you seen the Apple River, Wisconsin trial, do step five teenagers over name calling, killed one. I haven't seen that. I have to catch up on my on my world news, brother. AS said it's on a different album. I know, Holmes, but I'm saying it's history. As the gun album is just like it, Holmes. We both, both of those albums. Oh, absolutely, Funk Lover. Yeah, um, yeah, the GUN album is definitely history, man. Um, and there was meaning behind it. There was glitch out behind it. It was it was not just a musical album. It was meant. It was actually a filter. It was basically a filter. You know, um, you had to understand and be of understanding to uh, recognize that. You know, at the time, there was a lot of young homies that didn't. Me, fresh out of YA, 1997, walking around. Um, I understood the concept behind it and who was speaking and why and what they were speaking on. So um, I kind of got with that program. Mr. Gunner, do you have the WW tattoo on your arms like Wes Watson? No, I got the WS, though. I got the West side. West. Thank God now you eat Miracle Whip with your sandwiches. Gotcha. I don't. The, the white homeboy did. That's a white thing, bro. Hey, the white men, we love coffee, meth, and Miracle Whip. <laughs> the blacks and the browns could have the roaches, right? Please, refrigerator after open. Please close the refrigerator after you open it. Is my shit open? No, I'm good. Wes going to hoop that chili verde. That about those fucking asshole looks like a whole pile of straight chili colorado. Mayo with the lime and I'm white, says Gun Smoke. Juan Garcia says, you ever grill, Gunner? I do. I do. I grill pretty good. I'm not going to say I'm the best, but but I do grill, man. What did I miss, Gun? Oh, Adam, you missed it all, bro. We made chili verde. It's cooking right now, though, and it's looking spectacular, bro. Um, I hate Miracle Whip. Too sweet, says Cuba. Yeah, it does have an odd taste. It does have an odd taste. I just like mayonnaise, mayonnaise on, straight up. What you sipping on, Gun? Um, the Mountain Dew Zero, Zero Sugar. Only Duke Stow here in the South. Look, if you don't got this in your cabinet, you're not Mexican. If you don't, you're not Mexican if you ain't got that, eh? Straight up. Facts. And you know I'm ghetto because my shit squeaks. I want some so bad, says Nicole. I want some too. Facts. Uh, I was in Baker's in the Loma, and all the GUN homies pulled up deep, like 20, 30 deep. I shit you not, flamed up from head to toe. They did that, Ruben. They were on a campaign, bro. They did that in Merced as well. They were all walking down Farmer's Market. We used to have it every Friday. And uh, they were flamed up. They were handing out signed GUN posters. That's where my cousin got his poster at. The one I talk about, that's where he got it that day. Fucking uh, um, right there. He was all happy. This is my prized possession, right? I said, mine is my Bo Jackson jersey, but fuck it, I guess. You don't understand, fool. Uh, Mickey D signed it. So what, bro? Mickey D was over there smoking scante last week at the homie stat. Mm -hmm. What the fuck's the big deal? Did you give the recipe? If so, going to have to watch it. Man, I missed it. This and that, definitely. I cooked it with you guys. I showed you everything. Um, I got three big cans. JC, you know we got to stay on deck. My lady pointed out your kitchen and where everything is. And I told her, we're ghetto. She laughed because it's true. <laughs> It's what we do, man. What about mustard? How do we feel about that on sandwiches? I don't eat mustard, man. I don't like it unless it's like a, I use it as a binder for like a grilling. Other than that, I don't fuck with it. Why did the bulldog separate from the north? Then? Um, there's various reasons behind that ill cat. One of the main reasons being, bro, that the bulldogs decided that if for no other reason they were being oppressed, um, they were being utilized and they didn't like it, man. They thought that they had the leverage at the time and the numbers to do their own thing. Needless to say, they're still around. So maybe that was, you know, was it the right choice? I think not personally, but you know, it is what it is, man. Wait, I said, were any brothers on the GUN album? I said, yeah. Uh, Hurricane J, uh, fucking uh, uh, Gangsta Drew, 
It was a couple. Man, noodle was good for the hangover. It's bomb. Okay, sweet. That's right. This and that. That's sconted. Damn. Nice, simple steak, rice, and black beans always hit since PG3. Mr. KC said, what up, bro? I'm a little late. What are we cooking? We're cooking chile verde. Uh, last time I was in Merced off Childs for 30 minutes, there was an ambulance, a domestic violence incident, and someone tried to sell me some tools out the trunk. Active. That's my hood right there. Childs in R Street. Dead end. Woo! Yeah, oh, bro. You'll get sold tools, uh, windshield wipers, copper piping, catalytic converters. I mean, it's whatever you need. Dope. You might get shot and robbed. They'll sell you something and turn around and rob you five minutes later. That's 114% Buster Hard on that album. Um, was it similar to when the Hoovers dropped the blue rag? I was locked up as well when that happened, man. Um, similar. Similar. The only difference, Southside, was that when the Hoovers decided to, that shit happened over. The Hoover thing, bro, one day they were Crips. The next day they were just orange rag, bro. Criminals. They went from from uh, uh, Crips to Crims overnight. The Bulldogs, it was more of a a thing that happened over time. You know, and it took a long time to filter out to the streets. It took a long time to, damn. And they say the gun's all stuck up. My shit's looking nice, right? Um, The gun eats good. I do out of my tribe, man. I only eat mustard and potato salad. Mustard is nasty. I don't fuck with it. Yo, gun, you think Chano is ducking, uh, Ch uh Canelo. Is ducking Benavides? Yeah, I do. Ricky says, do you like to do coke when you drink beer? And not all the time, Ricky, because I don't drink beer. Um, I eat manudo. I don't drink it. I mean, I've drank it in the past, but it's not my thing. I eat manudo with pig's feet and pig ears. I don't do it with the pig ears, homes. I do it with the pig's feet. I love it. That's the only way I'll eat manudo besides the can. Uh, Papas de Puerco. I like that song, G-Love by Sir Dino Essa and Daddy's Home by Sir Dino. Very nice, says Michelle. Michelle. And that's just another daily ride through the north side. I remember when my primo said that. I said, bro, we ain't even in the north. Bro, this is like the southeast side where we're at. I don't know where the fuck we're at, to tell you the truth. On the GPS, it says, no bueno. All right? Fucking where are we at? Can you tell us how you got your Bo Jackson jersey signed? Oh, I went to San Jose uh, way back in the days, and they had like a signing. Bo always goes to Song Hole. He goes to Oakland, um, and they do signings. And I just went there and just got it signed. You know, it cost me some money. Very nice is Michelle. Thank you. I appreciate you, girl. Can you tell uh, – Mallory says Miracle Whip doesn't taste the same. I either eat uh, Hellman's or Duke's mayo. This and that. It's like this and like that and like this. And uh, arroz con uh, granules y arroz con – oh, man. Street Squeeze says in parts of Mexico they eat menudo with bread. I just started seeing that. Yeah, they do. Um, uh, pozole is good with bread. With, with the pan, they're called bolillos. The bolillo bread? Is bomb, bro. It has like a sweet taste. Um, but I like it with corn tortillas, man. That's just me. You know, I, I get them like that and I roll them up and, and I get down. But yeah, they do uh, eat it with fun, man. The fun lovers SC, you fuck with Mr. Key, Mr. Key from the suck of free. Yeah, bro. I actually know Mr. Key personally, too. Um, true stories, man. Mr. Key, uh, he to me, he was probably the best rapper out of the whole Dark Room Familia group. Um, him and Pollo. You know, Pollo's my favorite. Um, he was the Mexican Tupac, but Mr. Key, as far as lyrically, he had that Bay Area swag. He was just dope. He was dope, man. For solid. That's right. Mm. And menudo con pan. That's right, Michelle. Let him know. Uh, the, the bread man, yum. Started to see good Mexican food at NYC now. And the video drip, menudo in the can gun. Hey, on the late night tip, I ain't going to lie. That menudo and that Juanitas can hits differently. You know, especially when you're all fucking... Fucked up. One time Raiders came to Delos and played the police department in football. And then they had Howie Long because Tom Flores had ties. Do you like Young Dopey? Yeah, I fuck with his music, bro. I love Young Dopey's music, homie. Mm. Shout out to Young Dopey's music, man. Real talk. I like it when the sourdough bread bowls. Mm. When my wife was pregnant with my first kiddo, she would eat rice and mayo. Um, I tried it and now the rice ain't on point. I'll throw some mayo on that. We're uh, hot ham and cheese. My boy Mallard the Duck says, fuck all that. We're going to kill all that noise right now. Fuck Benudo. Fuck Pozole. Fuck all that. It's hot ham and cheese with Miracle Whip. <laughs> you like that green Pozole gun? Yeah, it's good, bro. I like clear Pozole with no, with not red or green, just Pozole. in and out or Whataburger? <sighs> it's got to be Whataburger, girl. I, I think Whataburger hits just a little bit better. What do you think? You can modify that Juanita's menudo, make it taste way better. I do. That's the way I do it, Street Squeeze. I never, 
I never just eating it out the can and butt naked like that, bro. That's a butt naked sopa. Yeah, I have to uh I have to add my own ingredients. I do that with everything. You know what I mean? I might put garlic powder on Captain Crunch. You never know what me. It just depends on how I'm feeling that day. I just seen that video of Lefty dissing Lazy Boy. Wow, bro, hella disrespectful. Julian, don't trip. I'll be doing something on that manana. Tap in. Roberto says, what a burger. Yes, that can man noodle is garbage. It's how okay. It is, but at the same time, bro, it, it is what it, what it is, brother. You know, when you can't afford shit else, green mole is good, too. And yes, what a burger is the shit. Brian says, hey, Fusca, uh, fall into the Cali State Premier dude. With the paisas, my brother. Brian, I don't really speak too much on the cartel business, bro. It's their issue, right? Um, but they would run with the paisas, homes. Hey, we up in this motherfucker better late than never. Motivator is in here. We got 169 in the building. 125 likes. Let's get it up to 300. Fuck with your boy, though. One time for some fun, though. Bro, are you serious, Whataburger? Your Cali card just got pulled. Hey, bro, I wiggle. That lets you know I'm universal. You guys out there aren't too different than us here in New Mexico. That's right, Roberto Flores. What's up with it, brother? Give me a torta, says Tahoe Kev. I got you covered like a state blanket. Jill Conley says, best ever a bread roll filled with potato chips. Mmm. That sounds good, Joe. At this point. Oh, my goodness. Let me mix this up real quick, you guys. Let me stir my shit. I appreciate you. Oh, my God. You see? Oh, yeah, it's almost done. I'd say another 20 minutes. Just because I want it to be falling falling apart, you know. But uh, it looks fire, man. It looks fire. And uh, it's just what it is. Gunner, that what protein on the show? Yeah, it's protein. Protein way, eh? Pure protein. You know, you know, I got to, that's how I get, that's how I, I stay cut up. I'm trying to, I'm trying to stay cut up, man. I'm not even trying to bulk up anymore. I'm good with all that. Like in real life, I'm six foot, bro. So, so I'm just trying to chop it up right now. That's what I'm trying to do. I'm not trying to get all big and I've been there. I've done that, bro. I've showed pictures. I used to be, you know, 260, 270. I'm good about maintaining that 200 right now, bro. Chico's Tacos at 2 a.m. is the bomb, says Michelle. You're the bomb at 2 a.m. Do they wiggle in Legrand? <clears throat> you know what? I could tell you a story about Legrand, bro. So we used to go at it with Legrand. It used to be the West Side of Merced against Legrand, Planada, Lafro Locals, RBL. Like those were the hoods. It was the North Side of Merced versus the West Side. And Legrand and Planet used to roll with the North Side, right? And it was like us, M Street, Ghetto Boys, um, 11th Street, 12 and a half, Body Merced Rifa, the whole West Side. Um, we were against them cats and we went and we'd have to go out to Legrand because I, my best friend, my homeboy, he's still act, he's still with shit, right? His lady was from out there. So we'd go out there, pull up to her spot. When we were there, it was all good because her brothers and everyone, you know what I mean? It was all good. Um, but her family was all from Lofbro. They were from the, 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 you know, the different water or the enemies and, and it was Legrand. So man, they caught us slipping out there one time. They was bucking all the way, all the way chasing us down Charles to the hood. <laughs> All right, all right. I'm telling the homeboy, Doc, Doc, right? We got to the pad. When we got there, we bet the corner, and there was a homie there with a chopper. <laughs> it was, we get active. We were, I don't miss that at all. Fuck no. West up, last meal, a torta. Mm. Get it together, bro. What's up, Los Ticanes or Los Tigres? Oh, Los Ticanes de Tijuana. That's my favorite. I like Los Tigres del Norte. They're bad, too, homes. Banda de Carro Rojo. But I ain't going to lie, man. Los Ticanes de Tijuana, my favorite song is Piñata, La Piñata, or Tres Animales. Mm -hmm. The bomb. What's up, Adrian? We got 170 in the building, 237 likes. If you haven't hit that like on the way in or out, man, make sure you hit it. I appreciate you guys. Thank you so much for all the um love I'm getting tonight as well, man. You know, I appreciate it. I try to do something a little different for you guys tonight. I keep my cereal on the fridge too. Your plan doing any bedtime stories anytime soon? I got you, Woofy. In fact, I got a thumbnail made up right now, man. I'm ready to go. Uh, what was your favorite alcohol to drink gun? Bucanas. Bucanas and pineapple juice together. Bucanas is my favorite. Or a shots of Casadores or um, Don Julio. 
How much can you bench press at this point right now, Jay Nelly? I don't know, bro. I maxed out one time at like 275. Um, but right now, to be totally honest with you, I could probably, I don't know. I don't, I don't know, man. I wouldn't, I don't want to lie with you. Have you seen Born in East LA? With, oh, yeah. Fuck me? No, fuck you. That's one of my favorite movies, bro. Uh, oh, Adam. I like Tucanes, but uh, the originales are bomb too, bro. Hey, love from Canada. What's up, Gina? How you doing? Gina Pacilli is in the house. I see you. Uh, my Theo and Thea are buried out there in the cemetery by Legrand. Oh, is that right? Um, JC, how's them tickets going for PS5? Get them to everyone, man. I'm, all everyone has to do is tap in, man. I haven't even been pushing it because we're doing next week, and I figure, fuck it, man. I'm going to break even on this one, and the homies asked out. Um, just is what it is. I like red beer, Clamato, and a Modelo. Oh, man, you're like a chelada. You're like a chela. Um, but they're not doing too great, JC. Just, you know, it's it's rough times right now. People don't have the money to spend on that. A lot of people already have it. So um, it's more so kind of a giveaway. Private party, Don Julio Angel Stadium. This is Adrian, man. We got 185 in the building, 242 likes. Thanks for the video. Thank you, Yolanda. I appreciate you, girl. Paul Costa says, sup from San Diego. Well, some man respects. We got 188 in the building, 242 likes. And I appreciate each and every one of you guys. Um, that are tapped in. They got the pineapple bucanas now. I know I heard, bro. I, I just haven't tried it yet. Does pure protein taste good? Ah, uh, not really. But I mix it. It's the chocolate flavor. So I mix it with milk. I make chocolate milk. I slam it real quick and it is what it is. I do. I, I drink my protein shake right after I work out in the morning. I get up in the morning right off the top. I do push-ups. Uh, wait, tickets for what? A raffle for a PS5. Uh, this and that. I got a PS5 that I'm, I'm raffling off. Um, $20 tickets and and uh, it is what it is on the cash app. Uh, how many tickets are left? Oh, it's unlimited. Adam, you can get as many tickets as you want. The more you buy, the more chance you have. We're going to put it on a wheel and spin it. And whoever wins it gets it. Uh, why do you say Buster Chapete but not Scrap, says Christopher Della Alba? I said it all. Um, when you were part of something, bro, um, I, have, I have it Buster tattooed on my head, right? Um, it's not derogatory towards me. It's not Chapete Buster. See, a real Norteño understands this, Christopher. There's no way to disrespect disrespect a Norteño. There is no way. Just like there's no way to disrespect a Sureño um, with words, homes. You gotta do it in a different way, you know. So, uh, yeah, I never tripped, homes. Bet the kitchen smells fire like fucking fire. How to get it? Okay, all right, this and that. What's up, Gunner? Your story's funny as fuck. Shout out from Santa Cruz. Sue. That's right. Clever gang. Fuck with Chicos. I see you, homes. Barbecue today. Hot dogs. Got an asada. Chicken thighs. Pork steak. Sounds good. Ooh. Leva. <laughs> uh, Chef Gun. Javier. JC's facts. Yeah, like, bro, Walter used to be trying to disrespect the Estrellas. You're calling me a star. Buster. I, yeah, I'll bust your whole face open, right? Chapete. With the big old cuete, you know what I mean? I, I, there's just, I, I just never took it as disrespect. It was more so the point that someone was trying to do that. Um, and I was taught in 1997 we had a junta, bro, and, and I will not disrespect the South Sider, period, bro, um, unless I'm going to do it right directly to them, you know? And I, at this point in my life, bro, most of my homeboys are South Sider, so it just is what it is. My primo had 114% buster tag. That's what I have right here on the side of my head, man. Uh, what about weed guns? You ever uh, had a favorite strand? No, nah, I never was into weed, bro. I, I never was into dope like that. Regardless of what people may say, Gunner's looking in the shit all tweaked out with guns. Like, come on, bro. Stop it. I got it, mommy. But, you know, it is for what it is. This scoop on me, homie. Give me a taco ASAP. I still have my star behind my left ear. That's right, JC. Um, I got a few of them. You know, I got... I still got my shit. My shit's all incorporated in, bro, and and all that, you know? Hairy-ass arms, huh? Uh, what is the raffle deadline? This and that. We're going to do it next week, next Friday. Not this Friday coming up, but next Friday. Uh, gun, check that carne. It's all good, high wisdom. It's, hey, it's bomb right now, bro. It's, hey, I perfected this recipe. I know exactly when it's done. What's up, Keeper 408? Javier. What's up? Isaiah Mitchell says, what's the star stand for? Just northern stars, like the North Star. Uh, Captain Morgan Coconut Rum with Vanilla Coke. That shit, that sounds bomb, Mallard. That sounds sweet and smooth. 188 in the building, 251 likes. Let's get them likes up, man. I appreciate everyone that's in here tapping in. Saca la bocita, says, more de Watson. 
Shout out to the city of Watson, man. Real ones from Watsonville. Uh, yes, sir. I'll explain more as you get to know me more. All right, JC. I appreciate you, brother. Um, that story about when you jacked all those weed plants was a classic. Oh, you're talking about the one when I had the phone and I went like this and I smelt it. You're talking about the story where my boy G-Funk was like, hey, bro, hey, there's a fucking whole field with thousands of plants. And I thought he was bullshitting me. And then my homeboy walked in and he just started crying. He goes, I'm fucking proud of you. <laughs> and that's a true story. Hey, my boy, Ezekiel Rivera says nothing like Captain Crunch Crunch Berries. What's up, Gunner? You like Manudo? That shit's nasty to me. I love it, Nathan. Manudo is one of my favorite staples, Holmes. Angeles West West says West Los Angeles in the casa. What's up? Que pasa, Holmes? I see you. That's it. Was Mac Dre and Orteño? No, Mac Dre was a sympathizer, though. Um, so what Mac was, bro, was you got to understand that Mac did a lot of time, um, fucked with a lot of functions with a lot of northerners out in the Bay Area. So he had a... Um, he had a mutual respect with a lot of the Northanians. He was real close with gold toes and all that. So he uh he just respected them, bro. You know, you respect who you fuck with. And in the Bay Area, the brothers and the northerners fuck with each other tough, bro. Uh Fools from Orange County represent the stars for some reason. Um, yeah, they got the star. They do the star as well. Pozole or Menudo? Menudo. Mac Dre, Mac Mall. Yes, Crest Side. Country Club Crest side to everyone on here. I send mine to you and yours. Respects to you all 100%. Absolutely. I heard Pee Wee Herman was a crip. I heard Pee Wee Herman liked to masturbate and fucking things to men. Menudo con patas. But no cebolla, says Ezequiel Rivera. He knows, my, he knows how I get down. Green pozole for me. It's fire. You have to show us the chili verde before you kill this live, bro. Hey, gun smoke. I'll show it to you guys. Look, let's do it because I'm about to kill the live in a minute. And then I'm going to show you guys the plato that I make. So let's do it like this. I'm going to do it right. I don't want to disconnect you guys. Wait up. But let me put you right here for a minute. You guys can look at my pot up there. The one I make my noodle in. You see that? You guys see that? Look. Look at that meat. It's almost done. You understand me? What's cracking with it though? In fact, let me put it on a little bit lower because it's ready to go. Did you ever do time with anyone from Porterville? Poros, bro. I used to be married to a chick from Poros. D. So yes, I've done time with people from Poros. Um, had family up in Poros, all that, man. Lefty versus lazy. Net bangers are active right now, says Julian. Man, it's an ugly situation, bro. I'll be touching on that. Should I do a video on that tomorrow, man? You guys want to hear my opinion on it? Because I have a fucking a righteous opinion on it. You guys know how I am. Ezekiel says, do you, do you use a pressure cooker? Charlie Holmes, I just use a regular pot. Um, that's right, says Tao Kev. Is it true that Jake Paul is suing Mike Tyson for $200 million? Why? Why? Because Mike Tyson's dick is bigger than his? Or, or what is it? Do you see uh, um, forever says, take that, take that lazy boy. Take that. <laughs> Did you uh, go cruising on Easter Mooney, McHenry, Kings Canyon, Charlie, bro. I live in Washington. So, but I've cruised all those places, Mooney Boulevard, McHenry, Kings Canyon and Fresno, McHenry and Modesto, bro. Um, you know, uh, story uh, Kings, uh, you know, story in, in, in San Ho, uh, cruise the mission, uh, main street in Merced. I mean, there hasn't there hasn't been a place I haven't cruised in Northern California, man. Lakers win again. Shout! Damn, you got down, demon. Thank you, brother. I appreciate you. Beast says, gotcha, 100. Um, okay, that's cool. Where the hell is Porterville? I don't know. Can you explain to me? Porterville's in uh, Tulare County. It's in Tulare County, man. It's right uh, by Visalia. Go gas, please, bro. I want a super north end. <laughs> hey, that's right. Hey, I got you guys tomorrow. No, so I'm going to do two videos tomorrow. So... I'm saying hit a one if you guys want me to touch on that lazy boy and, and uh, lefty gunplay incident. Um, I got you. And then you already got the fourth installment coming, man. Chile Verde is bomb. Just chilling. What's up, bro? How you doing? Is there a peace spot there? I'd like to see about different places. It's, it's lovely. It's lovely, man. Ain't no smoke. Patrick says, ooh, wait, the Chile Verde is thick like a Dominican Chica. That's right. Is your Impala done? Fill up. The Impala will be done in June. Yes, sir. Finally, I'm finally getting a little bit of money to make something happen. You did that, bro. Full blast. Thank you, Gunsmoke. I appreciate you. Did you ever cruise Olive in Poros? Um, I can't say that I have, brother. 
Ruben, I can't, can't say that I have. I, you know, Porterville is very small, bro. Mr. KC562, we usually, we usually would go to Vaisa if we're going to go cruise out there next to Tulare or Visalia, depending which way you're going. Says JC, absolutely. Kicking back. The homies just kicking back, being boom. Make some chile rellenos. I could do that too. Anything you want to talk about, I am down for. Says this and that forever. Says, cuz when I looked up Gunner Primo, some author claims to be your uncle. His name, something to a nine, or is he? Who is he, mijo? Um, you're talking about my primo, Latin active 209? That's just a cousin. That ain't the same cousin, bro. That's a knack. You know, you know, the cool story with him is that fool got money too, man. He works the oil fields and all that. He lives out in Texas. He's from Turlock, right? Got a lot of family in Turlock. And when I first started my YouTube shit, he was on me calling. He made my very first shirts and, hey, primo, we can make money. We can make money. And I knew he didn't need the money. He more so wanted the fame than the money. And that's not what I'm into. And so there was no disrespect there. I appreciated what little things he did for me and what he showed me. But he was all into like, hey, bro, we're going to go worldwide. We're going to do tours. And I'm like, tours on what, bro? Talking about prison? It ain't that serious, right? So we didn't have a fall off because he was going on my lives and, and whatever. And then when everybody fell off from my channel and, and started, you know, going in on me and, you know, a lot of people started talking shit, whatever. Trolls came in the, in the play. Um, he decided to talk a little shit to try to gain some friends, I guess. And I had to check him. And I told him when I see him at the fucking um, at the family reunion, I'm going to beat him up. And I haven't forgot. I am going to beat him up. So I hope he watches this and knows that one day when I see him, I'm going to grab him by his ear and beat him up. Alex Terona says, hey, Gunner, what's cracking? Your food looks delicious. Shout out to Orange County, Santana. Keep doing what you're doing. Hey, gracias. I appreciate you. Thanks again for making this. It is nice that you support your supporters as well. Thank you, B. I appreciate you. Gunner, have you ever had a breakfast burrito with chicharron in the middle with chile verde? Yes, I have. And it's bomb. High Wisdom says, heat the tortillas up. I am. As soon as the food's done, I'm going to heat up the tortillas um, with my uh, tomar which is right here, and then um, that shit's packed. Tell me you guys don't have all your pasta and shit packed like that, spaghetti noodles and everything. You know, you ain't ghetto unless you make spaghetti twice a week. We should do this cooking thing once a month. I got you, Gunsmoke. We could do that. Get the guns. Where's that torta, that folio? Uh, Ponle guard. Oh, they're everywhere, man. Um, it's freaking hot. Is it, Michelle? I'm going to get at you tonight, girl. Family uh, fight sometimes. It'd be like that. Yeah. No, exactly. Just chilling. I'm just going to beat him up and check him, and then and we'll be all right again. I love him. He's my cousin. I'll never – I don't want to see him die or, or something bad to happen. I just want to beat him up. You know what I mean? I just feel he has that one coming. Just like my cousin wanted that friendly fade, and I choked him out. Um, motherfuckers are sleeping on me. Gunner, I seen you box. You can't fight. Okay, well, I'll let you believe what you believe. No, nah, homie, it tastes better if that fun was bent up, if that pan was bent up. Um, I caught the live. Hater shit. Uh, what's up, guns? It's like a true Mexican, show us the oven with all the pans. But with this one, <laughs> you know I am. Body shots, man. It'd be crazy to drop off the super north anyway. Let's see what would happen. Um, he fuck around. Hey, my primo fuck around to get jumped. Me and super north will pull up because they're, they're cousins as well. What's up, two a day forever? Says I'm just sitting and it's quiet. All I hear is. Echoes of Diddy saying, take that, take that. <laughs> Fucking Diddy's crazy. You got to do the dance, though, when you do it. That motherfucker was like this. Hey, Mace was in the back like, Kevin Hart was like, no, no. Hey, 20 and over, versus familia. That's right, high wisdom. Wake your cousin up. Says Adrian, uh, dog, that looks like dog food. Uh, dog, that looks like dog food. Hey, Ricky, I can see you lightweight like to troll, huh? You like to have fun? You like to have fun, huh, bro? It's all good, Ricky. Gravy train dog food, says Ricky. All right. Well, guess what? Go go gravy train somewhere else, brother. Richard Castillo says, I do, and, and I'm not doing that because he's hating. I'm just, he, I gave him that guy plenty of chances. He just likes to talk shit. Um, probably a young kid. His mom's probably getting boned by a black guy right now, and that's unfortunate for him. But you'll get through it, bro. Therapy and fucking just doing that works from what I hear. SCU Rock Shaka Shorts, you should be all banged out, homie. Nah, Fung Lover, I don't do that anymore, bro. I'm a, I'm a grown man, bro. Some sweats, little white feeder, little hat, you know, up, tilted, just doing me. Red just hit that pussy. So let him know, Ezekiel Rivera. What's up, Gun? Uh, what's your favorite kind of torta? 
the ones that scream loud and scratch your back. The homie from Castro was like your primo at a house party. He pulled the old Tech Nine when he did it, like the way the conversation was going. And that was that, like in 1992. Uh, for he was from Castro. Adam D says, I has the Super North Bend ever been past Bakerfield to the south. Yeah, yeah, we went to LA a few times. Our primos live out in Wilmas. So, yeah, we, we split out there. Uh, Ricky, your super North Daniel stories are badass, bro. Always have me rolling. Uh, you ain't seen shit. Wait till tomorrow. Hit a one if you guys want me to drop part four tomorrow. I need to know. Because if not, we can put that on hold. And that Chile Verde is just about done. So I'm going to smack that in a minute. That's right. I love it. At McDonald's coffee. Uh, Yolanda, have you been to El Paso, Texas? I have. Yolanda, I got a feel out there in El Paso. Um, my familia is from Juarez, so I cross right over the frontera all the time. Um, I'll scratch your back, says Michelle. Oh, you're going to. Uh, that, that's that's already locked in, girl. You know. We already locked that in. Uh, what are your thoughts on lefty guns? Um, I'm, I'm going to give you my thoughts tomorrow, Anthony. I'm going to do a video on it in the mañana, bro, in the morning. Hey, gun, listen to uh, Huey Lewis in the news. Oh, yeah, bro. Ever, hey, my favorite movie in the world is Back to the Future, so you know I fuck with you. It's the power of love. love, love. I tell you, my fucking primo's old lady looks like Biff Cannon. The fucked up version, though, whenever he won at the casino or he had a casino. Yeah, I said to keep it real. I said kind of uh, upgraded a lot, too. I ain't really dressing like that. Yeah, bro, you know, when you get older, bro, you, you grow out of certain things. Chile Verde sounds bomb right now. It's about to go down. Stay tuned. Can we get a quick primo story? Please, guns. So let's get It's not my first or my last. What you cooking, fool? You can't cook. Adrian, just a little chili verde right off the Doma Olio. Believe me, bro. I've been known to get down in the cocina a time or two. Bro, are you ready for WrestleMania XL? You know I am, homes. Super Norteño's alarms were going off in L.A. Uh, the chili verde better. Hey, but here's the cool part. He talks all that shit. Hey, stop. That's a South Side right there. Let's get him. But when we're in L.A., I'm like, hey, there's a South Side right there. There's one right there, too. Hey, I think I seen one at the Tacaria. He said, this ain't my backyard. I ain't got to do shit. <laughs> hey, did the Tigers up north ever have a green light? No, they didn't, D. Not that I'm aware of. Joey says, I looked up how far Gustine was from Merced, and that drive was way too long to be called cruising. That was a road trip. Nah, Gustine is like um, 20 minutes from the town. It's on the outskirts. Gustine's not far from Merced at all, bro. It's uh, from where my hood's at. We go straight down. Um, we go straight down fucking... Uh, uh, um, it's been a minute, bro. Uh, we go straight down Childs, and we just bust a right and go all the way straight out there like you're going towards Sandy Mush, which is El Nido. You pass through El Nido, bust a left, and you're in Gustine. Show what's in the pot, brother. Uh, Chile Verde. I'm going to show you guys. I'm going to make it short and show you guys the finished product right now. What about Madera? What's that place about? Madera's with the business, bro. It used to be, you know, a long time ago. Uh, too old for the game banging. That's right, Paul. You know what? I'm going to get up out of here, man. I'm going to get up out of here. I know other people want to go live. I want to make room for them. I appreciate everyone that tapped in. I'm going to make a short right now of my plate so you guys can see. So make sure you tap in on the channel on the short, and you'll see the finished product and see how I get down. I appreciate respect, everybody. Thank you guys for coming in here. B, I hope that you're able to watch the replay. I'll leave it up so you can see what's, what's popping. And thank you guys, man. Um. You know, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to eat and, and do my thing, man. You guys have a great night. I appreciate everyone, all the love. Tomorrow, part four is coming. Um, I'm my primo. Tomorrow, I'm going to speak on the lefty gunplay and uh, lazy boy uh, beef that's going on and how that can impact um, relations between North and South in and out of prison. We got shit going down tomorrow, man, so make sure you guys tap in again, man. Also, um, the PS5 raffle is still popping. Unlimited tickets. Do what you do. 20 of pop, man. I know that people don't got it like that. Um, but someone's going to win it. So, um, respects to all you guys. Thank you guys so much. And, uh, I'll get out my Michelle in a little bit. All right. Now respects. Thank you guys.